man, guys, sorry that uh, before I like was in here and then I went back to here. And, uh, anyway, I, I'm, I'm still relearning how to stream, guys. It's been a while since I've done this regularly. Welcome to the stream. I'm super excited to be building today for the first time. Well, not the first time building. First time building a map in UEFN. I'm excited. Uh, I'm nervous. This could be rough, guys. This tools are still really new to me. I'm trying to learn, uh, and, and I'm ex just excited to get going, guys. But how's everybody doing? Welcome to the stream. We already got a bunch of people in here, guys. Woo! I'm excited. Sorry, we got some Mario music in the background. It's kind of loud. Let me just turn it down a little bit. We can leave it rolling, though. Um, uh, Kumu music, guys. If you guys don't know Kumu, there's links in all of my description to his music. He's insane. I love his music. Guys, how's everybody? How's everybody doing? You guys doing good? I'm, I'm excited to like actually build with you guys today because there's with UEFN, there's a lot of like downtime as you wait for things to update so we can chat and like and we can have questions and all that stuff. So I'm super excited to be here to guys. Wait, make sure you like up the stream if you haven't liked it yet. And uh, this will be fun. Okay, so let me kind of explain a little bit about what we're doing here. Sorry, music. Is that music too loud? Sounds loud to me here. Actually, probably what I'll do is just do this. I'm gonna turn it down on my head. That may, does that music sound okay to you? Is like it too loud, too soft? If it's too loud, put a big. Uh, just say loud. If it's too soft, say soft. If it's just right, just. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let me show you. I've, okay, I was gonna try to start from scratch. Uh oh, <laughs> there it is. I didn't start from scratch. I was working on this the other day, and. I just was like, okay, this might be an interesting idea for a map. Uh, and I, I just kind of was like, just wanted to kind of start rolling with this a little bit. Let me show you what it is. Yo, hold on. Thank you, sus edits. Let's go with the $5. Thank you. Okay, it's fine. Okay, bit soft. Okay, I can turn it up slightly. There we go. Um, so let's get, let's open up. So this is UEFN right here. You can kind of see, so what a, one thing I've built, I was messing around with the sequencer, the level sequencer. Let me show you what uh, it is. So right here, you can see, there, let's see. <laughs> Where am I pointing? Right there is this is the level sequencer I set up for this. And you can kind of see, this is like my cinematic here that I've made, and it's not cinematic. The cool thing about the sequencer is that you can interact with it. So you can kind of see here, like I have these platforms that are going down and then coming back up. And I kind of created this to go like regularly, just like it would just be on a loop. So let me show you what it's like in the game for a second. I, and what, what I want to do with this map is make a very difficult new kind of parkour slash death run. So uh, a lot of people were like, oh, he's making a Mario map. Well, this is kind of like a Mario map in that it's a platformer. So a platformer is, you're just trying to get from one platform to the other. Mario is like the classic platformer, right? Let's just play it. It's really hard. Let me show you that it's actually possible. I was kind of thinking I wanted to do kind of like the scissors 2.0 death run kind of thing. So you can see here, all of the platforms are moving up and down at their own like pace. And I mean, I have, oh, see, it's already so hard. It's like, and there's a lot of lag when you're testing these things because I don't, I don't know, it's just lag. But uh, okay, I'm waiting for that to drop because the sequence is really important on like, like knowing which one's gonna drop when and when to jump. Like this is a hard jump here. Oh, see, see it kind of lagged off the edge. But I wanna make these really fun, unique levels that are gonna be hard to like, complete and then when you complete them you're gonna feel like you're the freaking man right or the or woman or whatever you're the you're the best there is around oh okay i'm gonna do it here because this one is just a momentum jump yes ah! okay that is a possible jump uh, I, I don't want to do it but it, you guys can see that you can do it so now i did some pre-work on this a little bit uh let me show you i imported a whole bunch of new assets so let me show you what I got here. So these are all new assets that I got actually from the Unreal Engine market, like the UE5 market. Uh, oh wait, hold on. I got to catch up with some stuff real quick. Um, yo, Infinite with the $5 celebrate. D 
dude, thank you so much, Infinite, for the five dollars. And then we've got two dollars from Xpex Dex. <laughs> Expect Xpex Dex. Make it first person. Ooh, that this would be uh, nearly impossible first person. So I'm not gonna make it first person. But let me show you these assets I imported from the UE marketplace. Uh, ooh, uh, uh, they're not all appearing here. Let's see what happens. Why aren't they appearing? That's interesting. Let's just drag it in. Oh yeah, look at that. This is like cool, like rock. It looks kind of fuzzy in this, but I'll show you what it looks like in game. I don't know why the preview is not working though. Uh, it looks like maybe I have to like pull it into. Oh yeah, like 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 this is a tree I imported. It's pretty cool. Uh, I mean it's got its own little unique looks because I one of the things I wanted to do with my first map is not. I don't want it to look like Fortnite, right? I want it to look like something else. I mean, it'll still look like Fortnite, but I just wanted to look unique. So like here, I'm gonna pull in this. This is like a really cool pillar. And then I'm just gonna push the changes. Guys, this is what takes so long. You hit push changes and then you wait. You gotta wait. Like, and because you, you can see here, it's done pushing changes or it's, it's uploading the project and everything. And then we'll wait for a second and then I'll show you um over what happens in Fortnite. Okay, so now you can see here, look, that's the asset I just dropped in. Um, but it's taking a while up in the up above me, you see edit mode preparing. So it's just we're just sitting here kind of waiting. Oops, why is that doing that? Sorry. So we're just kind of waiting for it. Uh oh little uh let's see, fancy official, thank you for the two dollars. What do you think about UEFN development team? I think they're great. They did a great job. I think it'll be interesting to see how things kind of like play out in the next year or so as the updates come out. I want to see how, you know, they do like, uh, so I'm excited for that. And then little Teddy with a $2. Hi, love your vids. Thanks for liking my builds and videos. Hey, no problem. Thanks for, thanks for building and showing off cool stuff. Lemon Gaming, $2. Can you add Dino Head to Chomp you then? Go when, oh, I don't know what that's saying, Lemon, but thanks for the $2. <laughs> okay, so look, now here's that pillar in game. Ooh, isn't that sharp? That looks so good. Like I, and, and it has like full, I don't have mantling turn off right now, so I can't mantle this. But look, it has like collision, it has everything. So this is kind of like the style I'm going with on this map. It's gonna be like a floating island in the sky that you kind of, I don't know jump around from island to island. And I'm gonna do a lot of movement in this map. So that's kind of the goal. So right now, uh, what I wanna do is, because it's gonna look like this, I'm gonna delete this. I kinda wanted to try something on this platform because this platform looks, I don't know, like sci-fi. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change static mesh here. You can see the materials over here. I'm gonna change that to, oh uh, wait, what's it called? Uh. Do, 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 do. Let's do like these temple floor. Let's see what that looks like. Actually, this could be cool. Well, that's foliage. Hmm. Um, maybe like. Well, let's go. Let's let's look. Let's let's see. Let's just try a few down here. Uh, so wait. Let's click back on that. Let's get this mesh. Let's do. Uh. Statue. Oh, come on. Hmm. How about I do? Oh, here we are. Temple floors. Let's see what that looks like. Um, okay, boom. So like, look at that. The platforms already have that kind of look, but I don't know if I like that material. Let me, I want to try this other one real fast. What was it called again? Ground Atlas. No, I want sculptures is what I want. So let's try this again. Let's click on here. Uh, okay, so the, once again, I'm still so new to this. Sculptures. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, I mean, that's cool, but it has like the sculpture thing. Oh, no, that does not look good. So we're not going to we're not going to do that. Hold on. Let's uh, let's look at some of these other materials. Here we got the temple ruins. Sculptures ground. Let's just see what the ground. Well, that's ground. Now let's just see what that looks like. Let's try it. And then this will these are kind of be like the uh, Materials I use for these platforms. Let's try this. Ugh. Okay. Now we're just gonna use that. So I'm curious what that looks like in game, but let's uh 
Actually, we should probably do that. Let's just see what this looks like in the game, because this is something we're going to kind of like use a lot, I think. So we're going to push that. We'll wait a minute for it to update. And this is the problem with UEFN is like updating to see what it looks like in game versus in the editor just takes for freaking ever. Anyway, is Trimix here? What's up, tri uh, Trimix, Trimix, Trimix. I say Trimix if he's here. Good to see you. Uh, am I late? No, Mac, we're just kind of getting started. We just pushed some changes. I want to see what it looks like here. We're changing our platform from looking like this futuristic thing. And it'll still have the fire coming out the bottom. But I think uh, that's okay because it'll be kind of a mis mystical map, I guess. Like, so that it'll look more like this, the fire coming out. I mean, I think that looks kind of cool. And I did almost nothing to do that, right? I didn't make the material. I didn't do anything. <clears throat> Am I gonna make a new backrooms? Good question. Maybe someday. Uh, I, I don't have current plans to do it. I have other ideas and other plans. Um, and the backrooms is a lot of people are already making it in 2.0. So I, I don't know. I, I don't. I don't know. Okay, let's see what this looks like in the game. You know, that's not too shabby, guys. That looks pretty cool. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with that. I think. And you know what? One thing we could do too. Let me show you this. This is awesome. So I downloaded these uh like instances as well. These like spray paints almost. Let's try this. Where's a good one? Let's just do this one. Check this out. So I plop that down on it. And it like I kind of wait, hold on, let me move it around a little bit. Uh where is it? There it is. Okay, watch. So I'm gonna... There we go. And it kind of like wraps around the whole thing. Check that out! Oh my gosh! Wait, okay. I just want to push that change real fast. I just want to see what it looks like in the game. And I'm not sure if it like moves with the item I've got. And so then this that way I can have like the platforms look like unique. So we'll, we'll, just, we'll let that push real fast. But I mean, honestly... Whoa, what the heck? What happened in game here? Well, we'll see what happens once it's actually pushed out. Um, you love my videos, dude. Thank you so much, man in, man in a van. <laughs> man in a van. You should use the post processing volume to change the graphics and make it look more like not Fortnite. I haven't tried anything with that. Um, I'll, I'll give it a shot. I don't, I haven't even touched those tools yet. Um, let's see. Uh, fancy official, you should put an Easter egg somewhere like under the spawn, by the way. I may donate 20. Okay, thank you, Fancy Official, for the five pounds. And an Easter egg on the map. That's an interesting idea. Uh, maybe I'll think about it. Re Reese with the $2. I hope the time to push changes is quicker one day. Me too, because, I mean, we're just waiting here. Oh, look. Okay, it should be done here in just a second. Because <clears throat> I like to just see what it looks like in the game. Oh, my gosh. See, that is, that is cool. Wait, what happens if I move this? Oh, look. The decals are kind of like, it's going over my <laughs> spawn, like spots too. That's really interesting, huh? But if I put, oh, even if I raise it up higher, it's kind of like a zone almost. Whoa, that's interesting. Wait, what happens if I copy this? Interesting, interesting. Okay, well, that is cool looking though. Okay, so we're gonna kind of stick with that for now, I think. And we'll mess around with decals later, I guess. Uh, I'm still having like I still have to have my uh, 1.0 skills though for this to work. Okay, so let's go back in here. Let's add the mesh to all of these platforms, so that oops, so that it all looks uniform. And then we'll maybe start. Wait, what was the name of this mesh? This was the floor mesh, right? Um, maybe what we'll do is start building the next level or something. Uh, wait. Is that the name of it? Hold on. What was the name of that? It was... Yeah, floor. Didn't I not type in floor? Do -do 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 -do. Floor. Where is it? Temple floor. Okay, there we go. Dude, that looks sweet. I, I, I like it. I just like that there's more options on like 
like just everything we can do. We can do basically whatever you want as long as you can figure it out, right? Sometimes it's hard to figure out because we're all such noobs at this. At least I am. I like. I feel like there's some people that are doing some insane things already in 2.0 that like just blows my mind. And I, I don't know. It's gonna take me a while. I don't know. I don't know if you guys would rather see me build stuff or play stuff. I don't know. Maybe you can do more streams playing maps. I don't know. What would you think? Would you guys rather watch me build or play? Build or play in the in the comments. Let me let me know. We'll we'll see. But I mean, today we're building. I don't care what. I gotta I gotta do this. And this this map might take me a little while as I like figure out everything. I want like to have like sound effects in it. I want to do all sorts of things. So this is gonna take me a little while to build just because I'm new to it. And I, I want it to be good, right? Okay, so there we go. We got our platforms. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let me work though. Actually, I don't know if I want this lap, last platform to be like an actual platform with fire underneath it. Let's see. Build, play, build, play. Like, let's see. There's a lot of bit of both. A lot of builds. A lot of building. Hmm. Yeah, right now everyone's built. Okay, we're building. Baby, I love it. Make sure you like up the stream too if you're watching. Okay, let's work on. Actually, maybe let's work on this platform here. Uh, hmm. Here's the thing. I want this to kind of be. I don't. Yo, haunted. With a fifty dollars high muster, have you heard of a multiplier multiplayer one v nine horror game called Extraordinary? It's a game where you have to survive as a player as an um extraordinary in an old sci-fi complex until 6 a.m apparently it's coming out soon you're super hyped that sounds awesome to me i never heard of it uh i'm not like super into horror games even the horror maps kind of freak me out so i gotta be careful what i play <laughs> uh so yeah i don't i don't uh, i haven't seen it yet okay wait i gotta i can't see the preview of everything here for some reason maybe i can oh look at that why is that interesting? So I can bring out everything. Oh my gosh, it's stacked on top of each other. But I can now see the preview. Look, I'm just gonna click on the ones I can't see and then we're gonna bring it out into the map and then I'll just control Z it. Watch this. Oh yeah, control Z. Now I can see all the previews of everything. Perfect. There's always a workaround guys. There's always a workaround. Perfect. All right. <clears throat> so what the heck? <laughs> wait, wait a second. We're getting to immature. Yo, uh, K KDGF with the nine dollars. Woo! Have a great day. I'm being nice. Thank you so much. That is so kind, guys. You giving me money is crazy to me. And an immature with a hundred dollars. Press likes, people. Thanks for helping the community, dude. Thank you so much, immature guys. Immature, one of my favorite builders out there. Love him. He's doing lots of cool stuff. Excited to see more stuff that comes out of his projects. Uh, Mass Man with the five dollars. If you were to make another backrooms, would you make more than fifty levels? I don't know. And also, what type of map are we making here? This is like a platformer, so we're gonna do like a jumping around, having fun, cool-looking map. All right. So here we are. I think what I want to do because this is just kind of a stationary spot. I don't want to move like the actual like location of this because actually, hold on. Let's make it bigger. Maybe let's not make it too big. I don't want to mess with the like meshes too much to make it look funky. So what I can do is just. Oh man, guys, I'm still getting used to these controls. Actually, I'm curious if I change this up a little higher. That'll be easier. Oh yeah, there we go. Look at that. Now I can delete this thing. And this can be kind of like the platform you jump onto. Uh, oops, I didn't want that. I want to copy it. There we go. And then we can kind of build around this, like like even this can kind of look like a ruins or something. Like that could be cool. So let's let's see here. Oh oh yeah, look at this. Forgot about this thing. Might be kind of cool to have like. This could be like a checkpoint. And oh yes, and check want to check out something cool? I learned that you can actually import some really cool effects too, like some of the Niagara effects. Let me see if I can find it. Where they go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? 
Where's my effects? Oh, there they are. So let's see. Like, check out these effects. Like, this is just downloaded with this map. I don't know if I can make it bigger though. That's the problem. I like. I would love it if it was like my checkpoint almost. Right. Let's see. Can I make this bigger? Do, 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 do. Oh, looks like maybe I can. Yes. All right. Sweet. Uh, so watch that, and then let's make this a little smaller. Ah. So isn't this cool already? We got like one of the coolest checkpoints I've ever seen in the game. Look at that. Baby. Never seen a checkpoint that looks that good in Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that, but it looks awesome. Hold on, let's change the grid snap. I can move this a little bit better. And that can be our checkpoint. I love it. I'm already in love. Uh, but oh, you know what's kind? Of, this is kind of funky. Hold on, let's pull this out again. It's like crooked or something. Let's try this again. There we go. I feel like that is looking a little bit better. Cause I think I was using the wrong button to like move it before and that was kind of making it a little bit wonky so i'm still trying to get used to like hot keys and stuff too i can do this better and quicker but let's go okay all right there we go all right so then like what we can do now is we can select this and that we can move it up here actually i might want to make everything just a little bit smaller Or actually, no, I think that's all right. Um, yo, Cynthia, my name is with the $10. My name on Fortnite is, there's the name. If you guys, I, I mean, there you go. I don't know if I can friend you. Oh, look, I can't, I can't resize both at the si same time. Interesting. Hmm. Is that too big? I think it's probably hard. All right, let's, uh, hold on. Let me select this. It's like that. Let's line it up a little better. And this will be, this will be the checkpoint. And then I can just build around this a little better, I think. So like, um, let's find something good here to... Oh, that was that same piece I just had. Uh... You know, it might be cool to have some like stones. Ah, there we go. Yo, Memer, I've heard from a big creative builder that a 1v9 horror game will be releasing soon. It's called Extra Order. Wow, wait, what's going on here? Is this like a... Uh... Is this or, or <laughs> what's going on? Someone already brought that up. Is this am I getting spammed? Sounds cool. I'll have to check it out when it comes out. I don't know who that big person is. Is, it, is that Cypher? Cypher coming out with a horror map. You know what's interesting about the horror maps, guys? I love them. I think they're cool. But uh, also something is that's interesting is my audience. Like when I do horror things, they like leave the they leave the video. Like you can see like a big drop off when they like uh like when I'm in my like analytics. So it's really interesting. All right, hold on. Oh, this is weird. Oh, oh uh, okay. It's weird. <laughs> just trying to get used to all this. You know what? Actually, this might be good if I just blew this one up. Let's see what it, let's just see what it looks like. Hold on. Cause I'm like we're like going for like a I don't know like a floating island here almost. Oh no no I don't want that. Oh man I love Control Z. That is so beautiful to be able to undo things. Just to be able to undo it is spectacular. Okay hold on. Um Master oh, Directed P with the ten dollars. It was great teaming up with you on the Terrain 2.0 video. I love the textures you're using. It's so cool. Um, oh my gosh, I cannot see all of the... There we are. Um, let's see. This is something I haven't learned yet. I'm learning so much. Dude, yeah, so... And I learned directing Pete today how to import stuff from UE. Like, because there's so much... There's so many free assets and stuff on Unreal... Oh my gosh. On, like, in the, the, the marketplace on... Um... 
just for normal Unreal Engine. And like, there's just so many cool assets there. So like, that's one thing I'm like, I was super excited to learn how to do that today. And be like, oh, that's how you import like quickly. And like, I got all of these assets really fast. Ooh, okay, that doesn't look good. So let's hold on, let's do... See, I'm curious, I don't even know how to like reset the alignment. That's one thing I should probably learn how to do. Oops. At some point, like if I have an asset, you can see right now it's kind of like crooked. I have no idea how to like reset that. But this is pretty, this is starting to look pretty decent. Right here, this little like, like entrance to the map really. I mean, gosh, level one is already, oof, it's a, it's a doozy. I don't, I think a lot of people are going to like, <laughs> going to lose on that level and just be like, give up. But this isn't for the faints of heart. This is going to be for like, you know, I, I want like to like make people rage. Like I want the laser beams and the muse elks and the and the streamers of the world to come and play this and like just rage, rage against the machine of the mustard machine. Right. So look at that. That's so cool. Woo! OK, this is starting to come together already. Oh, man, I, it just takes a lot longer. I feel like everything takes longer to build because I'm just still such a novice at it, right? But I think we'll get there. It just takes time, right? Whenever you're trying something new, it takes a while to like just get used to tools, like a tool set. It's like, I don't know, it's like you're using a saw for the first time and you don't really know what you're doing, but then after using it, you know, I don't know, for a while, then you're like, oh, this is cool. I have no problem with this. And before you know it, you're a pro. You're the one who's like teaching other people how to use the saw. And right now, everyone out there doing like tutorials and stuff, they're all learning too, right? They're, everyone's learning. And we're all just trying to like figure it out together, which I kind of love. I kind of love this stage of the community. We're all just kind of like learning. Oops. Learning the tools, learning the tools. Like it looked that, I kind of love that, that it like auto like adjusts it to like the angle of like the other train. That's pretty cool when you hold it in the center like that. It makes it almost feel a little bit more authentic as, as opposed to like these ones over here, which I didn't do that with feeling a little bit more. There we go. That's awesome. Actually, check that out. I hope my memory isn't like killed by this. OK, this is cool. And then what I could do is I think I've got some steps in here. Yeah, there we go. Bring in some steps. Let's uh, just, uh, I don't want to do that. Hold on. I want these to be very flush. So let's see what happens if I stretch it. Does it stretch the, yeah, I probably got to be careful with stretching these imported meshes. So I just got to go a little bit more. Oops, 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 oops. All right, guys. There we go. And then let's do nice thing though about this is once I build this like bottom stairs, watch this, I can select all of these. Like so oh, did I select? Mm, I don't wait a second. How do I deselect this? Okay. I don't want. Oh, there we are. Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> oh, look, I can, I can select them all over here. That's probably easier. And then I don't think I got that one. Okay, there we are. And then I can just copy these like that and then move them all together so I can make like a longer staircase. Okay, that's pretty sweet. Right, and then let's throw in a checkpoint just because we are, uh, I don't want to forget. Checkpoint. Uh, Where's the checkpoint? Player, Wait, what is this? Trap player. Where's my checkpoint? No check player checkpoint trigger cue. What is this? What is this? What's going on? Where's my checkpoint? Hold on. Someone ah, guys, I get so many. There it is. I don't know why it wasn't coming up. Um, I get so many spam calls. Are, are you are, are do you guys get spam calls? You probably I don't know. I don't know how old you are when you start getting spam calls. It's like I get 10 to 20 a day. I mean, I'm not there's no I am not lying. Like it is, it is that much every day. I get so many freaking spam calls. It drives me nuts. 
All right. Um. Oh wait. You know what I should do? Oh yeah. Hold on. Oh wait. Actually, no, no. I don't want to do that. Watch this. Want to see one of the coolest things? Is you can highlight all of them, and then over here, I can change this to visible in game. I can click it, and that updates all of them. Isn't that insane? Gloopy with the five dollars. Thank you so much. Harry Grant with the two says, "Will you do something similar to the back rooms?" I don't know. I don't know. And then, oh my gosh, Fortnite Creative HQ, just the hundred bucks. Love your dedication as the positive vi vibes you bring to the community. Appreciate, appreciate you, guys. Fortnite Creative HQ, they're awesome. They also do streams um, based on, uh, on on everything. Okay, I want to I want to push the changes. I want to see what this looks like. Let's see if this doesn't crash everything. So right now, this is what it looks like. Oh man, look at that. <laughs> There's our island. Okay, wait, we gotta wait for the changes to actually push and then we'll see what it looks like. So you can see this is kind of what the platforms look like before, but we'll see. But Fortnite Creative HQ guys, they do streams. They do all sorts of things. I mean, gosh, I've used their website so much, especially before, I mean, I feel bad about the prop like finding props because in UEFN, you can just search it. But I use Fortnite Creative HQ all the time. They're awesome. Guys, make sure you go check them out if you haven't. Thank you so much for the $100. It means so much. Thank you, thank you. Wait, did I miss another? Wait a second. It says Immature donated twice. I don't, I think I just, just the once. Um, Guys, you left 20 minutes ago and dang, this looks good so far. Dude, thank you. I'm like, it's coming together. Like, just like that, right? Spend a few minutes. And it's starting to look really cool. And this is going to be fun, too. I just want to see what it's going to look like. This is taking a ton of time to update. I'm actually worried about how long it's taking to update. That must mean it's huge. I don't know. Because, oh, what's this mean? I don't know what that means. Uh, That's the problem. There's like things that come up that I don't know. Like, look, you can check your project size. It's calculating. I don't know. Maybe it doesn't happen while it's updating. Let's let let's let it let's see what happens. I'm I'm nervous. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, guys. Am I are you adding trophies? What is that? I don't know what that means. What do you mean? Am I adding trophies? I don't know what that means. Like into the, the map? Look. As soon as we have real leaderboards, I'll be adding leaderboards into all my maps. Cause that's so fun to be like, oh I this is the number one world record in this map, or this is the, they collected this many ty uh, I don't know, coins in the map, or this, this is the max kills or whatever. Like I'm told, like that is, I think one of the top, well, look, the number one priority that I think creative has right now to update in updating UEFN is adding persistence. You gotta have save points. You gotta be able to like save your data. Like if you pass level one, then you don't have to come back and beat level one again. Whoa. Okay, guys, check this out. All right, look, these platforms are looking freaking cool. It's like a sci-fi ancient thing, but then look at this. Oh man, wait a second. I, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, can I make this jump? I don't even know if I can make this jump without momentum. I don't think I can, but I wanna actually, hold on. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn on a uh, player flight. See, I'm still using 1.0 stuff. <laughs> Because <laughs> I just don't know where it all is in UEFN. Okay, so let's start the game. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, dang. How cool is that already? I mean, we got these like moving platforms. And then we can jump over here. Actually, this might this jump might be easier now. Oh, hold on. Let's. I'm going to try and just do this jump. Let's see if I can do it without dying. Woo! Oh, there we go. And then that's our checkpoint. Boom. Oh, beautiful. I love that little effect there. That is so cool. This makes it feel epic. Oh man, that is so sharp. Yeah, I'm really happy about that. And let's just check, check these stairs, make sure they feel good when you're walking up. Oh yeah, that feels nice. Look at that. Okay, that's awesome. All right. Money, that's a good start. Oh, I forgot about the decals. Okay, let's add a decal on this. Actually, I'm curious though what the size of this is. Uh, let's go back here. So so you can go up to your project and see uh, project size. Oh, there we are. So right now it's 20 megabytes. Already? I'm trying to remember like how big it can be. 500, 400. Yo, the textures are a lot. Wait, what's the like 
actual okay it's 3000 memory oh, i gotta be careful maybe uh, hopefully like once i'm like using the same textures over and over again it won't add too much i don't know i don't know i don't know what i'm doing guys i don't know what i'm doing but it's looking decent I, like i'm feeling good at how it's looking and if it doesn't work well it doesn't work <laughs> let's try uh hold on just want to see what this looks like what happens if i put this on I don't think it works down there. It might work up on top to have like more. Yeah, I don't love that. And you know what I could really use though is like some like, I don't know, like foliage or something of some sort. There might be like, oh wait, I think there was a paint. I had not a paint. It was another decal that was like foliage. Hold on, where is it? Um, hold on, let me see. Let me let's do it by material instances. Oh yeah, look at that. Mm, I don't know if that looks good or not. I don't think that looks good. Oh look, that looks good. It just took a second for it to like, I don't know, update. So let's, let's see. Look at that. That's so freaking cool. Look at that. And I can like, it like merges. Oh my gosh, guys. That's fantastic. I bet this is taking up like a ton of memory. <laughs> gosh. Oh my gosh. That's, that is so cool. It's just like a material instance. Interesting, man. I have so much to learn. That's cool though. Look, it, it like goes up onto, oh man, that is cool. Wait, hold on. Let's move this one up a little higher. Oh man, wait, what's this other one? That was that one. What's this? Oh, this is like longer, flatter. I just want to let this like, look, there it is. You kind of got like the moss coming down. Actually, that uh, doesn't look terrible. Hold on, let's do, uh, what is Look at that dude that's dude that's so weird you know what gosh playing creative mode always feels like i'm playing a game right like the building creative mode always felt like yeah i'm building in fortnite but like this feels like i'm making a video game it just feels different There's something different about it and, and i don't know if it's good different or bad different or just it's just different it feels different guys and i don't know i don't really know how to explain it it's just like there's a different feel to it I, and i think it's a good thing oh look this instance isn't quite working on this so we got to be more careful about we're replacing it i don't know I, I i like it i like it guys i like uefn a lot it's just gonna it's just a different feeling it feels so different where can you get assets okay there's a lot of different places so like some of those animations i've done in my um like shorts that you've seen like the i don't know if you saw like the train one uh that was a sketch fab i got that so sketch here i'll show you i'll show you so this is sketch fab sketch fab.com you just come on here and you can search 3d models and stuff like i don't know like we can't do like we can't download we're, we shouldn't be doing ip stuff but let's just do it anyways like like let's do yoda and check it out like here's a little cute little baby yoda yoda i don't know if this one was free or not <laughs> i don't know <laughs> but yeah this one's free i can download the 3d model like you can download that if you wanted i wouldn't suggest it so that's one way but where i got all of these assets today i'll show you um hold on so if you go to your Epic Games launcher, 
Um, just a second for this to load up. So, if you download the Unreal Engine, which I highly recommend, like the actual Unreal Engine, you launch up here. But if you come to the marketplace, right here, hold on, give me a second. I see some donations. Direct and Pete, I'll get to you in just a second. So, under the marketplace, there's a ton of stuff here. Some of it's free, some of it costs money. You can come in and spend as much money as you want getting stuff, but if you go to free, and then you go free for this month, check this out, guys. There's all of this stuff here. So the, what I'm right, using right today is called the Isometric World, the Sky Temple. And this is actually, all these assets were built for a top-down dungeon crawler game, right? But I was like, is this good enough for 3D? And it says it in here that it is. So I was like, I downloaded it and looked at it and I loved it. And it was all just free. And they have new free stuff every month. Oh, whoops, sorry. Um, every month they have like new free stuff where you can come and look like there. So I downloaded these other ones. There's this under like water one, all these cool assets that are in there, like the shark or there's the also, let's see, what is it? This big star station. So it's like a little bit more sci-fi got really cool lighting and it just looks a lot more futuristic like like sci-fi stuff so i'm just gonna come in here every month whoops sorry sorry once again i don't know what i'm doing i'm gonna come in here every month download the free stuff and then you can also just look for stuff that might be cool right just look under free like oh like some of the other things i downloaded was uh these materials i haven't had a chance to play with them yet but there might be something in here you see that's like fits the style of what you want or it might even give you, like, inspiration of what you want. Okay! Guys! Maybe I'm back? Okay. I think I'm back. I think I'm back. <gasps> oh my gosh! <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry! My, my, I was trying to do too much to my computer at once. Like we, I had my stream going, my OBS going. I had UEFN going. I had Fortnite going. Then I had the Epic Launcher going. I had way too much going and it just like crashed. Everything crashed. I hope I didn't lose. <gasps> okay, okay, good. We didn't lose it. Let's save. We gotta save. <laughs> I was like, I thought UEFN crashed, but it didn't. Thank goodness. But Fortnite crashed. Oh my gosh. That was scary, guys. That was scary. Okay, that's how you get it to assets from UE. I'm not doing that again. It's gonna crash my computer if I'm doing it all at once. <laughs> oh, gosh. All right, thank you guys for being, uh, for coming back. Uh, let me just catch up with the donations. Um, Directly Pete says the Fortnite Creative Reddit that Mustard launched is a great place, that's right. Fortnite Creatives. Thank you, DP. And Isaiah, thanks for the dollar, guys. Thanks for well, being back. What's up, Ryan Sellers? Good to see you, buddy. I feel like I haven't seen you forever. We got one of the old mods from back in the day. All right, guys. Oh, sorry about that. Getting, getting stressed out. <laughs> stressed out. All right, let's uh, let's keep building. Let's just keep building. All right. We've got this really, really cool little entrance area. Um, I feel like what I want now is. Let's do, let's do, let's copy this like four. It'll be like the next level up, I guess. Do, 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 do. And then we'll go like this to our next level. Actually, hmm. Actually, I don't know if I like that. Hold on, let's delete that. All right, this will just kind of be like, I'm gonna build this kind of going up. I feel like, so this is one of the problems is like, I feel like building everything is just takes more, right? Like I'm, cause you're actually like making a video. I mean, there's some things that are like faster, like this, watch this. Now I can like move this over here. Although I missed a piece. 
Actually, that might be okay. Because then it makes it look a little more... A little bit more unique when I do that. There we go. Right? And then let's just make sure we have some rockage. <laughs> What's happening? Do, do, do. I, I don't like that. Hold on. Let's roll in another one. Let's do a... Uh... Oh, that's cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I just learned something new. Check this out. Oh, look, and now I can just sort by... Yo! That is awesome! I can just have, like, quick... Okay, that's... That is fantastic. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, so I, what I want to do is... I don't want textures. I want... I don't want materials. I don't want that. I want... What's it called? Static mesh is what I want. Where's the static meshes? What? Oh, there it is. Okay, there we go. Because the static meshes are like my props, basically. And so I can just filter by that. Okay, that's sweet. All right, now... Uh, hmm. What was I going to do? I was going to pull in some rocks, right? There we are. And I can make this bigger. Plop. Wait, I don't want to. I don't want to grab it by the middle. I feel like that's what's caused my problems in the first place here. Let's rotate it. Still, I'm trying to get used to my hotkeys. I need to be using my hotkeys more so that I can like do this properly, right? I want it to pop through the, bat the bottom. Okay. And then I can pull in some of these smaller ones over here. Right? Not that anyone's going to see over here. That's This is my, one of my problems. This is the same problem I have with... Ugh. I have the same problem in 1.0, right? Is you're like, I'm, what am I spending my time on? Like, what is worth my time? Is it adjusting these rocks on the side that no one's really gonna see? Wait, what happened? Something. I feel like something happened to this. Oh, I, you know what? I think I forgot to copy it. Yeah, that's fine. Um, yo, Isaiah with the two dollars. I need a shout out, please, for support a creator. What's up, Isaiah? I mean, <laughs> I'll tell you right now, shout outs don't work. I like I've had shout outs from the biggest creators in the world, like Laser Beams, uh, Lachlan's, like uh, like Cipher PK uses my stuff all the time in his videos. It doesn't do a dang thing. It hasn't moved the needle for me, like, when it comes to, like, subscribers. Like, at all. Like, and it never has. Even when I was, like, a much smaller creator, it, like, never moved the needle for me. Like, the only way you're going to grow is by making content that people want to watch. That, that That's it. That is the key right there. Right? That's the key to content success is making content that people want to watch. And... And I, for some people, for some reason, people watch my content and like some people do not, not everyone. Right. But that's the key, man. If you need to like, if you're trying to get to a thousand creators, a thousand, like whatever, although you don't need that anymore, by the way, for, to get a support of creator code, you just can, as long as you're 18 and have uh, a bank account, oops, you can get a creator code. And also, don't be related to anyone that works at Epic. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my gosh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you, look at, are you seeing what I'm seeing, guys? <gasps> look at that. That is a crazy little thing. All right, wait, hold on. I gotta... Uh, watch that. That is... I didn't know you could do that with all of them. Like, look at that. And it makes it kind of like... That was cool. Oh, I like that a lot. All right, so that's kind of like leading up to our next thing. Although this does not look great. I, I don't care if I don't see it. There we go, that's better. Let's see what it looks like on this side. Yeah, it's fine. And maybe what I could do, although this once again, oops. Uh, let's see, we're going like that. Do, 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 do. Beautiful. Okay. That's cool. And, oh wait, hold on. Just in case, like, so this is one thing I gotta, you gotta consider when you're building. What if some render artist is like, oh, I love your map. And they come in here to play and they're they're building something off of your map, right? And they're like, oh, I'm gonna do this cool video. And oh, but it looks really crappy from this one angle, right? Like, oh, dang, if you had just done a little better right here, maybe I'd make a whole video that gets a million plays and then you're gonna blow up. That's fantastic. Look at that. Oh man, that is so cool. I'm in love with this tool right here. Just how it's like moving and it like organically makes it look pretty decent. Oops. Oops, 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 oops. This is so weird. It's so weird. <gasps> I can't get this. There we go. And then let's just copy this down here. Isn't that fantastic? I mean, I'm not trying to like toot my own horn here. I just think it looks like, well, look, 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 yeah, here's the problem. There we go. I, I feel like it just kind of like comes together here. It looks really cool. And it's not, I don't feel like it's me. I feel like it's the tool that's making it look so cool. And like these prefabs that I found Man, that's cool. All right, so now we can go on to level two here. So we got level one, pretty basic. Level two, let's bust this out. This is gonna be freaking cool. All right, um, let's see, Robin with a membership, dude. Thank you so much, Robin. Oh, I, there's not a lot of members on this channel because <laughs> I haven't streamed a lot. My goal, guys, is to stream. You know what's problem here? Hold on. Uh, let's see, where's the, oh my gosh, I've already had so many assets. Um. Where's the effect? How do I find, what's the name of that effect? Let's go to my filters here. Let's do, I want effects. Oh, here we are. It's the, what is it? Rune circle one. There we are. Just want to move this over a little bit. It feels like it's a little bit, I don't know. Just, it looked a little wonky. All right, I just want to push the changes, see how this feels. Oh, you know what we could also put in here? Actually, I'm not just looking curious what they're like um hold on let's just okay i, I want to see like um clouds hmm oh did that freeze oh oh my gosh 
I'm curious if these clouds fit with this build. You know, I don't think so. But look at this. The static mesh of the that I have on here or the material instance is going onto the clouds. That's interesting. I feel like I don't want those clouds. They look kind of funky. I think I want like misty, like a misty FB effects or something. So I'll, I'll work on that later. But let's go ahead and push this. I want to see what it looks like in game. Here we go launch session. And now we wait. How do you import those assets from the marketplace into UEFN? Good question, Orca. I'm not going to do it right now because uh, it'll crash my computer as I'm trying to stream. I, I can do it off stream and then like, like maybe I'll do a video on it or something. Um, but you bring them into your, un, your UE project and then you can right click on like your assets. So like, I, I wonder if it looks what it looks like here. So if you right click on your asset, uh, let's not do that. Let's do a static mesh. Um, like, okay, so let's see. Oh, it doesn't work in UEFN. You right click on it and it, it's a little bit complex. It just takes a little bit of, you, you basically you like save it into your folder where like into your, like, I don't know, like right into this folder for this map. Uh, it, there's some videos out there. It's a little too hard to explain without like actually showing you how to do it. So I don't, I don't know what to say. But it's a little bit of a complex step by step. I found a like here. Let me see if I can find the. Let me see if I can find the tutorial for you that I found. Um. Aha! Here it is. So this is this is a different thing that they're importing, and I didn't have to do all of the steps. But I hear I'm gonna drop a link in here for you. Hopefully you can grab it before the chat goes wild. But there's a tutorial right there on how to do it. Or the, there's the, some of the steps are in there. All right, we're loading up here, waiting for it to drop. And I just want to see what it looks like in game. You're developing a game where you can create any genre and 2D platformers, with the level editor and share those with level. Awesome vibe. That sounds so cool. Um, press the cube with a plus sign, then press volumes, and then press post processor volume. Uh, I'll, I'll, I don't want to like do anything yet that I don't really understand. So like the pros processing, we'll see. I, I just don't know. I don't know how that goes. Do I stream for money? Says Gamer Pro. I, I don't often stream. Like I, my goal right now is to stream t one to two times a month. Cause for me, it's a way to connect with you guys and talk with you and like, and like, I don't know. I just like to connect with you guys on a deeper level as opposed to just like my YouTube videos, which I, are great. But they're not as I don't I don't feel like I'm like talking with you guys as much like I try to get in the comments and oh man. This feels cool. It's a little bit those stairs are not super smooth, but they're smooth enough. Let's see, oh, you can climb up on these. Oh, OK. Oh, you can't on this side. This one's just a little low. Interesting. Yeah, that looks sharp. Guys, that looks sharp. All right, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> I don't know about this mossy stuff. I mean, it definitely adds, but I'm worried about it, like, not on everything. I, I'm, I'm worried that I'm gonna have to, like, put a lot of this on there, and I just don't know, like, if that's a good thing or not. Like, I, when it comes to, like, Actually, I'm curious if I can make it bigger. Whoa. How does that look, though? I don't know. Does that, is that going to update? It looks kind of funky on the side when I, up, when I make it bigger. Like it looks not good. Oh my gosh! Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't, I don't know if I love it. Let's take it off. I mean, it looks good there, but like I'm worried about it just taking over, right? Like it, it might not be worth the memory. 
Like, let's see, let's find the decals here and just delete it. Let's see what it looks like. You know, I think it looks fine without the, the decal or without, without the, the moss. Like, I might, I might add it in later. But for now, I think I'm going to leave it off just because I, I don't know about performance. All right. Next level. Let's do this, guys. All right. Uh, please tell... Don't... Okay, never mind. I, I'm not going to read that. Uh, if we go back and get the light goals... No, guys. The back rooms right now is... For now, is over. Like, I just... Like, I know you guys love it. But it's going to take a lot of effort to, like, redo it in UEFN. And I just... I have other things I want to do. And, like, I love the back rooms. Trust me. You know what? I don't need... I don't think I need to do this. Let's just do this one. Oops. So, I like, I, I, I get it. I get that it's like, oh, you guys love that series. But also, the series was kind of like... The views were were kind of getting a little bit, you know, it wasn't as attractive anymore. And I don't know if that was because of the back rooms or because um, it was just 1.0. Like people were getting like over 1.0 and they're like ready for UEFN to come out. I don't know, but sometimes, you know, all good things must come to an end. And that was one of those good things that must come to an end. All right, let's... Uh, Okay, I have I have an idea for level two. I need to think about it though. I don't okay. I don't know if I want to keep these platforms. Like I think I might want to just do this. Where I'm gonna use this platform. And it's gonna be magic that makes it move, right? Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to add a level sequencer. Ah, there's so much stuff in here. Okay, we're going to do a cinematic level sequencer. And we're going to call this level two. Oops, no spaces, no spaces. Level two. Okay, level two is created. Now we can... What we want to do is this is called oh my gosh there's so many ground pieces uh can i rename a piece i can't see can i attract i want to attract that no shoot what's this called groundstone six instance okay groundstone six is what we're looking for groundstone Gosh, ground stone six. Okay, it looks like that's the one I got. All right, sweet. Uh, let's see, we want to transform location. So we're going to start. Oops, oops, we're going to keep it here. And then let me just, I'm just going to show you what this works like. So if I move it over here and hit track there, now you can see it's going to move there. So I also want to track whatever this is. This is groundstone five. All right, so we're going to track groundstone five. And we're going to track this location. Oops. Right there. Okay. So now what we're going to do is I, I want to create a level that kind of you have to jump back and forth between these two platforms. Like they're going to diverge and kind of do different things. And you're going to have to like choose which one to be on. And that will determine if you survive or not. So it's going to be like a pattern. So let's start location two. We'll have it kind of move one, two. It's like move that one out there. Wait, which one is this? This is ground stone five. And then this one. I'll have it move there. Oh. I don't know why that... Sometimes I don't understand how this works. There we go. 
So when you jump on this, I'm going to have like a trigger that sets this off and it's going to go. And then I think that's probably close enough. You can jump it between the two. So then we're going to go boom. And then we're just going to actually can I do both at the same time? <gasps> you can. Oh, that's that's fantastic right there. Okay, and let's do so that's the two second mark. Let's make it a little slower. Oh, why didn't that keep? Shoot, hold on, let me try this again. Huh. Interesting. Why doesn't it? Hmm. Interesting. It doesn't hold like so when I click it. So I'm still like not quite understanding how this works, but that's all right. We'll just do it one at a time. We'll go here. Track. Oops. Actually, you know what? It might help if I like grid snap this. Oh, yeah, let's do that. So we're going to do like a high grid snap. That way it'll stay on course better. And then I can just do one, two. Boom. Look at that. Now it's flush. So now as we start off a level, it's going to go. And maybe I'll have like a pillar or something in the way so that it can like it's going to block like where you need to be. Maybe I have floating stones or something. I don't know. And then what we'll do is actually let me extend this out. We're going to make this a longer level. I don't really know how this works. Yo, what's up, Carla? What's up, Benja? Guys, welcome. Are you going to add cutscenes? Yeah, uh, we'll see. I have memory. Yeah, like if you get to the new level, it'll kind of show the level. I think that'd be cool. Uh, Gons with the $5, you can make folders in your outliner to keep organized. Oh, I should do that, Gons. <laughs> I really should. Uh, that's like actually probably a good idea, but uh, I still need to figure out what I'm doing here. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I think at this point, so that was the first three seconds. Actually, that's kind of fast. I feel like that's too fast. What's going on here? Auto save. Okay. Hold on. Let's I feel like I want to pull this all out. A few more seconds. So watch, did that work? Hopefully that worked. So it's going to move, jump back and forth, back and forth. Okay. And then from here, let's go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's going on? Why can't I? Oh, I see why. Why can't I select that? I can't move it. Because this isn't... I'm confused. Why can't I, like... Move this now? Okay, I can transform... That's weird. Why can't I move this? I can move this. I'm confused. Should be able to move this. Hold on, let me, uh, maybe if, uh, let's go back a little bit. I don't know. Check your grid snap. Thank you. Guys. <laughs> I was like, what? I can't move this at all. 
<laughs> oh yeah, 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 okay. I was like, why am I? I'm, I, I must, I must be going crazy. All right, I was going crazy. All right, so here now, let's do this. Oops, oops, oops. Let's just track one grit, one at a time. Um, actually, let's just do this after like two seconds. I don't know, like, see, that, I don't really know what I'm doing here. <gasps> like, it's just it's a lot of trial and error at this, right? Hold on, guys. Just testing my editor. All right. Sorry. Okay, wait a second. So, oh man, isn't that cool looking right there? That just looks cool. Okay, so let's do, uh, let's see, that was one second. Let's do a few seconds later. Maybe two seconds later. Yo, Richie with the $10! Are you hyped about the creator profile coming on the 12th? Huh? Did I miss some news? Richie with the 10 Guys, make sure you go check out Richie. He's awesome. He's got a ton of tutorials. What are you talking about? Creator profile coming on the 12th. What did I miss? What did I miss? What did I, 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 I miss? Is there some news? I missed some news. I must have missed some news. I'll have to check that out. Uh, I don't know. Yes, <laughs> I'm hyped for anything new. Uh, <laughs> uh, wait, no, that's not what I wanted. There we are. Oh, dang it. Hold on. Why isn't that? Oh, that's why. Hold on. Okay, and then what we can do with this one is we'll have it come down. So you probably what I should do is just let's level it out right, right here. Get it on the same level as my other platform. And then I can go out to the side and go. So let's see what that looks like. Oh, why did it stop? Oh, it's because I have... Shoot, there we are. There we go. Okay, there they go. And... Swap. Oh, that's pretty cool. That was pretty cool. But I'm worried about this spot right here. all right might be okay so let's okay let's consider that the level right you're gonna have to get from here to over there that'll be the level right so it's just a little platform but we're gonna put some things in its way so that you're gonna have to like pick which side to go on and that kind of thing okay so that sequence is done i think let's add in the uh, hold on. I just want to see if there's something going on over here. Which tunes? Where? What? Where? Will there be a code? I hope so. I'm still working out if I can even publish, guys. <laughs> what am I building? Just a fun, like, parkour type map. Okay, so let's let me show you what to do from here. Hold on. All right, let's do a cinematic device. So this is how you kind of, uh, this is how you activate it, right? So the cinematic device is the what connects to the level instance device. Ah, uh, come on. 
What in the what in tarnation is happening here? I don't know what's going on. It's fine. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually have some triggers that I'm gonna put right over here if I can do that. Okay, classic trigger. Let's make it a little bit bigger. So it triggers on both. All right. And then this trigger is going to be not visible in the game. We don't want any of the sound effects. Okay. And then uh, then this we're going to do on triggered play function. Uh, wait, 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 what do I do with this? <laughs> okay, wait a second. Play function. Wait, what the heck? Where's my... Oh, here we are. It's level two. There we are. It's going to play level two. Uh, when trigger. There we are. Sorry, I'm still trying to figure out this like mechanic system on triggered. Okay. And then what do I want this to add to at the end? I want it to loop playback or just restore state. I think it's restore state. Let's try that. So it just kind of stops back here. Let's see what happens. Okay, we're going to push the changes. Make sure this works first before we start putting objects in its like way. Let's see. Okay, I don't know why. I don't know what that is. But let's wait for it to update now. Okay, we'll see. Let's see. Oh, what? <laughs> wait, did it automatically put these in now that it's been uploaded? Interesting. Interesting. I don't know. I don't know what that is, but let's wait for that to update. And I'll answer some questions while we're while we're at it here. Uh, Mario movie was just meh. Oh, guys, I don't know. I've been seeing mixed reviews on it. Like, obviously, the I think the the like the actual critics that hated it, or like it was got an under fifty percent on the Rotten Tomatoes. But a lot of people that have been seeing it have really enjoyed it. So. I'm going to go take my kids to it because they're we've been playing through Paper Mario and they kind of love Mario World and, or the Mario universe. And so I'm going to take them to it. I'm excited to like check it out. It was awesome, said creator. What's up? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> why did my guy just fall? <sighs> oh, 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 my guy's just moving forward by himself. Oh, it does this sometimes. I don't know why. Look, I, no hands, mom. <laughs> Stop. Okay, he stopped. Wait, why is this still visible? I turned off visibility. Get out! Oh, wait. Oh, I can just see it in the game mode? Okay, wait. let's just try this. All right, here we go. Oh, no. Hold on. We got to... I got to do uh, spawns in location. Because I don't want to do that level. I've done that level. It's possible. I don't want to do it ever again in my life. This is really hard. <laughs> So we want uh, spawns, join in progress. A uh, spawn location is current location, and then respawn type is not what I want. I want post game is pre game location. Okay, there we go. All right. Okay. So here we go. You finish level one checkpoint. Let's hop onto this, and boom, look at that. We are on the road. We can jump back between these two, and then. Oh! Oh my gosh, wait, we gotta jump back to this one. Ah! Oh no, it disappears. Okay, that's something interesting. I gotta think about that. Uh. So at the end of it, you gotta jump off. Interesting, okay. That is cool though. That is cool. All right. Okay, I can work with that. It works though. Boom. Boom. Gotta jump between. You gotta duck under this one. You gotta jump up. Oh my gosh, it's moving. All right. So yeah, we'll have to come up with a good sequence on that. Um, How do you animate? 
I just kind of showed it using the level sequencer. Uh, if you stick around, you'll see more. Actually, right now I'm going to pull it up because I need it. Level two. So you can see here, I'm using this level sequencer and I'm just putting like different things. So now that I have this here, what I should do is uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba. let's put a let's put an end platform uh, over because that's where it ends, right? Oh, one thing I didn't look at is if it like actually reset. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that there, right? Like that. Hold on, let me actually like, let's, let's play this again. Oh look, it's auto like adding it to me. Cause once, oh, that's, that is nice. I don't have to push every update to add new platforms because um, it's already been added into the game. Okay, so here we go. I'm trying to get to this other level over here. Zoom. Oh, that's cool. And then you got to jump off before it disappears. And did it reset? It reset. So in case I die, it will start over. Oh, that is. That's money right there. That is super cool. Woo! Then you can jump off. Okay, that's cool. Oh man, I love this. <laughs> so different. It's so different. Okay. All right. Okay, we got our final plat. We got our next platform. And actually, you know what I want to do? I'm going to delete this platform real fast. And save myself a little bit of work. And you know what I should do? You're right. You know, I should organize this better. I wish I could just like, hmm. Uh, hmm. I'm curious. I just kind of do all of that. And then all the cliff rocks. Ooh, I don't want to do that. Shoot. So cliff rocks. Boom. Round. Boom. Temple. Let's see if this. Let's just see what happens. Oh wait, I want to make sure I get the. Uh, um, what's it called? The Niagara thing. Where is it? Where is that? Where is it? 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 Called. It's called the Rune. Oh, I've got it. Okay, so here we go. Let's do this. So boom. Uh oh, okay. I thought it was in trouble there. A look at everything I copied. Whoops, that's a lot. <laughs> you can see the. All right, hold on. I've selected too much. <laughs> hold on, a one second. Hold on. Let's uh. Uh, give me a moment in time here. Let's see. We're going to see where this ends and then I can move this. All right. And I can delete other stuff that I don't want in just a minute. This makes it so I don't have to build everything all over again. Okay. Maybe just a little bit further out. There we go. Okay. And actually, I think I do want this. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What I don't want, though, is some of these things over here. Definitely don't want that. And hold on. I think there was a teleporter. I don't want that. Delete that and then hold on. There's another player. Let's 
spawn pad. Where is it? There it is. Let's delete that. Okay. Uh oh. Oh yeah, that's okay. And we don't need these yet. Here. Okay. Sweet. All right, now let's try this again. So there we go. That goes back there and bloop. And then it's going to pop back at the end. All right, so now what I need to do is... Actually, let's move this. What I don't want is someone to fall down. Okay. And maybe what happens... I don't need checkpoints, right? I don't need a checkpoint. What I need is... I need this... Teleporter. I don't want checkpoints. I'm actually going to delete these, I think. This will still, like, look like it's a checkpoint, but it's not a checkpoint. Because what I can do is then just do this, where um, if they fall into this... Wait, hold on. Yo, Arcade with the $5! I think it'd be uh, pretty cool if the moving platforms fall into the abyss near the end, just so that it's not so abrupt. Oh, that's a good idea. Arcade, that's that's genius. Yo, and... and Duncan with the $10, hey Mustard, I have a way to reduce your memory. I'm a UEFN Alpha chat on Discord. Are you able to add me so I can... Uh, yeah, maybe in a little bit. Maybe shoot me a message or something after the stream. Uh, or like on Twitter or something, and I'll, I'll hit you up. That'd be great, actually. I'd love to know that trick. Uh, all right. Wait, let's... So yeah, let's, uh, let's add a little bit at the end of this. That's a good idea. Our cape. Amazing... Matt Maker himself. Wait, what did I just do? Okay, so what we'll do is go boom, and then we can go just. And what we'll do? Wait, what one was that? That's this one. Boom, and then this one needs to go down like that too. I already have. What? What just happened? Did I click the wrong thing? Hold on, what just happened? There we go. There's already precedent for that on this map. Or on this level. Oh, I see what's happening. I don't want to do that. There we go. Okay. That's interesting. I didn't realize you could do that. And then... Zoom! Look at that! Boom! Oh, that's cool. I love that. All right. So let's okay. Let's make sure this. I get my uh, mechanic set up right though with the with the uh, um, teleporter. So the teleporter is. I want it to teleport to. Um. Teleporter to. I want it to be teleporter to on enter and then this one I can delete I think did that what just happened what did I just do it just disappeared what the? Oh, I think I did something wrong all right let's just uh let's just throw in a new teleporter that'll probably be easier no I don't want to do a new teleporter I want this one all right let's just do a new teleporter Teleporter. All right. This one is pointed this direction. Let's point it. There we go. And then, hold on. Sometimes I feel like I need to go into. I, I like. I need to go to. Um like 1.0 to like do my mechanics because I just don't know what the heck I'm doing. No, no, I don't want player exiting zone. I want entering zone. 
Cause like, I can't, oh, play visual effects. No. Visible, no. I don't want any groups. I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, okay. Let's see if that works, shall we? Let's push our changes. Here we go. Oh, we gotta end my game. And see if this was working. Oh, like, oh look, oh here, even I can look in here. Okay, that's cool. All right, let's see if this works. Uh, push the changes, and then we'll try it out. What are my making Sky Games asks? Uh, just kind of like a, a, a game, like a parkour map, right? Basically is going to be what it is, but this is like a 2.0, like awesome parkour map that can be really hard. I'm going to make it. This is going to be like scissors death run, but it's going to be the mustard death run, right? It's going to be hard. And I just, I just don't, I have a hard time just being like, oh, here's just a death run. That's fun. Like I, I want to make it look cool and different too. Right? So I, whenever I do a parkour map, sometimes it's like off of a new mechanic, like mantling or something. I still want it to look halfway decent. Right? And that's what I'm trying to do here is using all the power of 2.0 in like making this look cool and have like different type levels and things. So that's that's the goal here. Like I want it to be different. I want it to be fun. And I want you to like leave the map feeling like that was cool. That was something different. Like I've I haven't experienced that before or I haven't seen that visual effect or I'm I don't know. That's kind of what I'm going for. Should I even continue creating 1.0 anymore as Creative 2.0 is just so much better? The, the making stuff in Fortnite as I only have console says long. Oh, that's such a good question. You know, I've seen, whoa! I've seen, already seen some great creations since 2.0 has come out from 1.0 map makers. So like there's, there is value to 1.0 still, right? Uh, and here's one thing, I'm using so many skills currently that I learned from 1.0 in my 2.0 experience. So like you currently have, you don't have, wait, let me make sure this works. If I jump down and die. Oh, why is it saying that sound? And it's pointed the wrong way. Hold on. Why is it making the, it shouldn't make that noise. So like even here, so look, you'll, you'll notice I am using 1.0 stuff right as i as i build this as well um hold on let's see i want to do play sound effects Psh, no that's the conserve momentum no face player and tell yes okay there we go that should work better so like even there you see i just i didn't know how to do that in one 2.0 so i busted it out in 1.0 so like i feel like you want to eventually get to 2.0 is the goal right and and hopefully at some point epic is making tools for that are in 2.0 in 1.0 as well right so that oh that's crazy Woo! all right that is kind of awesome and you saw it drop off there wait hold on i want to drop back down i want to see what it looks like when i drop off if i'm standing on it do 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 <laughs> that is so cool wait a second oh wait i don't have mantling on oh yeah i can oh so here's the problem is if you die early you still have to wait for it to finish this animation that's okay oh that's cool where it drops off at the end so yeah i would stay still building 1.0 still learn the make like watch what people are doing learn on your own and then when you can afford a pc get one Right, go out, mow lawns, uh, clean bathrooms, uh, get a job, I like go work at Wendy's for a summer, earn enough to get a PC, get a PC, and then you can start killing it, right? I don't know. I just feel like if you're young, now's the time to like learn and to grow and like invest in this. It's, it's a good time to do it. Um, so yeah, still, still build. Um, Beckett Mac Films with $2, thank you so much. And Rat with the $2 just got here, so awesome. That this is finally real. I know it's wild. I can't believe it. All right. So now let's build some things in the way, right? So we've got our mechanics down here of how it's working, but now I, I feel like I need to like, we got to make it hard, right? So we're going to pull up our sequencer again and we can see where we are at each point along this animation. So right here, I think I want to have like pick the left side gotta jump to the right so what so we gotta block 
this, right? So, mm -hmm. how do I do that? How do I, uh, you know, I should probably just pull in some assets of what I want to be floating out there. Do, 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 do. Uh, maybe this could be a good one. Yeah, that's good. Wish it was a little bit easier to like put things down. Like honestly, 1.0 sometimes is a little bit easier to build in slightly. So now let's see. So I got that asset there. Wait, I feel like I need some cool stuff on here. Let me let's like do like statue. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's a cool looking statue. Hold on, guys. Give me a second. What? Typical Gamer. It's TG in the chat. What's up, Typical Gamer? New member. One of the, one of the like, one of the 10. <laughs> I'm not a streamer. Typical Gamer, he streams. He's awesome. Love Typical Gamer. Here, let me show. I'm going to show Typical Gamer some of this map real quick. This level work count is insane already uh hold on let me show let me just make sure this is in the right spot though real quick can it go through is that weird that it goes through it i think that's kind of weird i we can't do that i can't we can't have that that's too weird for me uh wait what did i just do i just wait is why is my mutator zone on this how did that happen? That's weird. Okay, yeah, we can't, we can't have that. We can't have that. All right, hold on. You gotta go like, I like the statue, I really do. But what we need to do is have it be like, we gotta delete the statue. Okay, so that is going to, so what do we put? Maybe I just do this. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Does that make sense? Is that going to be weird? Be like... <laughs> I don't know. That's pretty cool. Actually, what? Oh, I got an idea. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Uh, hold on. Let's do both of these. And then what we can do is bring. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, this might look funky. Uh, I'm not. I might not be in love with this. But let's just see what it looks like. Well, let's just let's play it through. Play it through. Wait, what is this? Why I got two? I got two pieces here. I don't need both. What's going on here? Why can't I? Oh, there we are. All right. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, hold on. Yeah, I'm not. Okay, I'm not loving this. Let's just, let's just see. Let's see. Let's watch the animation. <laughs> okay. I mean, it is cool. It's like like a, almost a perfect fit, but I don't love... Maybe what we can do is just get away with... Oh, I got an idea. I got an idea. Check this out. Okay, so we got these platforms here, which I think is okay. Right? It's We got the rocks in the way, but we got to make it feel mystical. So what we're going to do is I'm gonna add in one of my Niagara effects here. Uh, where is it? Check this out. This is gonna be freaking cool. Let me get bigger. 
And actually, it might even make this harder. As it's like, whoa, that is actually huge. It might be too big. We gotta, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I think we gotta keep it small. <laughs> Just keep it small. Actually, that's, I, 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 know, I might wanna reduce this actually. I like this idea though. It makes it feel like, okay, there's a reason these things are like, I cannot, why can I not adjust this? I was able to adjust it before. Oh my gosh, it's massive. Oh, you know what? It looks much better when I'm not, like, it's not highlighted. Oops. How do I get my Niagara effect? There we are. It's just because it was highlighted, it made it feel like a lot. Ah, come on! Where's my mouse? Hold on. Cannot even see my mouse. There it is. All right, let's see what that looks like in game. Let's end the game. And then what we can do is see. Where's my level? That's cool. I don't know, guys. That feels cool to me. Especially with the like effects going around it. it just feels like Okay, there's there's some there's some magic going on here. All right, let's push the changes and see what it looks like in the game. Although I'm curious. Oh yeah, look. So those assets were haven't been imported yet. So we got to push the changes. Here we go. All right. Sweet. So if typical gamers still here, so basically I'm building a platform right here. Go from this level. This level's already super hard. This is like scissors de level death run, and. You can see, like, we've already imported some assets. It looks pretty freaking cool, I think. It looks very 2.0. And then you're going to jump on this, and this is going to be the next level. I can't wait. Yo, Beckett! The $2? You think I can make a Chapter 2 map unpublished? I don't know. I don't know the rules with Epic. Honestly, I don't. And Smokey with the dollar, thank you so much. An Emerald Life with the two, two pounds. You should make the rocks crush. The right moving one. Oh, like, oh. So uh, you might jump on the other side. Oops. Let me think about that. I think I like that idea. So, like, they kind of, like, move together and boom. Or, like, boom. Maybe they crush right before. It's like, and then they, like, just come up enough. Let me think about that. Let me see how this looks once it's done. Oh, it's up to date. Okay. Look at that Niagara effect. That's pretty cool. I kind of like that. There might be another effect I can do. So here we go. Boom. And you can see. And then we got to jump back over to this one. Ah, no. Oh, no. It's already hard. Okay. We got to wait. Zoom. Okay, here we go. So we'll go through this one, and then there's gonna be another rock there, and then another rock there, and then something in the way. Oh, this, this is gonna be weird. And then we got this effect here going in the middle. Oh, that's cool. All right. That's 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 cool. You can make it so that the rock is whole and the platform slices through it. Hmm. No, I kind of... Oh, like, it just goes like... So maybe, like, hold on, let me just test this real fast. So, like, it comes in, it's like... Oh, I wish I could. I don't have, like, a skill yet to be, like, it explodes the rock or something. Because it's got to reset each time. Like, it's got to make sense for each level. Like, even if I die, it can come back and it resets. That would be awesome, though, if I had, like, an effect where it's like... Mm. But I think I could do that with an animation. Like, I kind of like the idea of, like... 
where they start like so like here we go let's just try it let's just do it we're gonna track cliff rock six cliff rock six no that's not what we're tracking but what is this cliff rock six What was it, 06? Is there a different? Oh, yeah, it's Cliff Rock, 06. There we are. So, like, maybe what we do is... Okay, so right... By the time it gets here... This goes... Up here... Oh, whoops, I forgot to put a starting spot. So it's gonna come up by then. And then, boom. Okay, so like, okay, let's try that. And then what we can do is with this one, let's try this. So this one is the frog 23. Okay. Let's set this one. Jeez. This is like my brain. <laughs> my brain. <laughs> well, that doesn't make sense though. If it goes like here, this goes <laughs> still goes through it. Maybe what I could do is here, I got an idea. Let's let's do it like. Let's do it so it comes. Mm, hold on. So let's see. How do I? Can I just delete that. Yeah, you can. Okay. All right. So right. Basically, maybe what I'll do is that once it gets here, these will come down like this. There we go. So it's like, but also I don't know how that kills. Is that gonna kill my player or just knock him off? Or like I don't know. Like, what, how does that work? And then maybe by the time it's out here, it returns back to. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Okay, you know what? We're gonna just Control Z this. We're gonna hit sit. There we are. What? Oh, jeez. It's because I'm clicking the wrong... I'm like, what's happening? I'm clicking the wrong thing. Oh, no! What have I done? Shoot. There's just too many things. There's too many buttons. There's too many buttons! <laughs> Alright. There we go. Gosh. There we go. Alright, so it goes... Yeah. I think it's gotta stay... It's gotta stay down a little longer. So I think it needs to stay until like right there. So here we go. And then let's try this again. So boom. Here we go. Boom. Sorry guys, I'm like focusing right now. I gotta make this work. So it goes. All right, let's just test that out. See if that works in game. If it pushes me off or kills me. And if it doesn't, I can always add like, I can add a damage zone or something here. that just kills you. Let's just try it. Push the changes. Um, Lewis, Roblox Studio or Creative 2.0. Please be honest. I have never used Creative uh, Roblox like studio. So 
I'm going to say creative right now just because it's what I know. It's not what because I think it's necessarily better. It's just what it is, right? Okay, so I, honestly, I think they both currently hold on. I got to open my door. It's so freaking hot in my office. Just a second. There we go. Now I can cool off. Um, I have, my office is in my basement. So my basement is like freezing. But when I close my door, it gets so hot. All right, edit mode is preparing. Let's see what happens when I run into this. I don't know. I mean, collision is on this, so it should knock me off technically. So I shouldn't have to worry about like what's going to happen. Whoop. Where am I? <laughs> Where am I? Oh, there we are. Okay. There we, there we go. <laughs> All right. Start game. Let's see what happens. Okay. So if I'm here, look at that. That's cool. It stops me. What happens if I'm, what if happens if I'm in the middle of it? It does it kill me. I don't think I can actually get down and in, into it. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, what if I'm here, though, and I jump over into that? Okay, I can't. I don't think I can. <laughs> so that's actually pretty cool. Hmm. And I still like that Niagara effect in the middle of it, making it feel like these are magical stones, right? Hold on, I just want to, like, see that. That's pretty cool. And if we have, like, stones that are moving like that along the way, I think that could be pretty magical. Like that could be a really fun looking thing, right? So you see that and then you gotta jump over here. There's gonna be another one, you gotta jump over here. And then over here, I'm gonna have to have something really challenging so that it's just, I just want it to be hard. I want it to be kind of hard, but also cool. Woo! Uh, Among Us map. Well, I don't know about that. What name of the music you're listening to? Uh, I, so if you look up Kumu, K, oh, sorry, Q-U-M-U. -U. He's allowed me to use his music for my whole channel, really. And he's awesome. So go check him out. You can find all of his music there. Okay, I like that. I don't know. What do you guys think? Is that cool? Or is it Y for yes and for no in the chat? You love it? What am I doing? I'm building a map. Uh, you can attach the Niagara effect to each stone. Question on that. Can you add Niagara effects on the timeline of the sequence? Hmm. Hmm. I don't see why not. I, I, I mean, it's just a... Hold on, let me pull this out. So this is called PS Rune Flying. Let's just see if I can actually add that. I don't see why you couldn't. Uh, so PS, this one is, hold on, let me see. This one is 01. It looks like you can track it. I don't see it. If you can track it, then you can make it move. Uh, let's see, rune, circle one. Yeah, it looks like you can. Oh gosh, I hate this. Here we are, hold on. Yeah, it looks like you can. I don't know if I necessarily need that. I think that would be a lot. Like it might add a lot to there where it's like, like I think if I were, I think I might add too much like memory to that. Like I wish there was like, I'm, if I could, if I was good at this <laughs> yet, it'd be cool if it was like when they come together, there's like, it was like a cool Niagara effect or something, but I think that'd be a little too much at this point of like the map making process. It might be cool though if I add like a little like jitter to it. Like it's like it's like floating and they come together at that point. But I don't know, that might be too much too. Hmm. What is this? Wait, hold on, hold on. Skip. Give me a second, guys. Uh, by the way, guys, if you're here, 
Make sure you like up the stream if you haven't already. Lewis, so we already answered that. Um, you can get it to crack. Yeah, so am I using Verse today? No. Guys, I don't know. I, I am not into the programming yet. So I think I'm just going to leave that. And then we got to build out the rest of this level. See, this is why... This is why 2.0 is like a little bit harder. It just takes longer to do everything. Like, usually I could build a 10 level, really like intense death run in a couple hours. Right? In, in 1.0. Just with kind of what we've got. But this is so different. It takes so much longer. It takes so much longer. Okay, so here we go. What we're going to do is go boom. And then what I need is two more rocks. Hold on. Ooh, that could be hard right there just by making it a little bit earlier in the sequence here so you're gonna have to jump right as it's coming out oh i forgot to copy over a niagara the effects uh let's see it's 10.56 in Germany. It's bedtime. It's bedtime for you. I can't stay up past like 10. If I stay up past 10, then uh, I, like, I'm dead the next day because my kids, they like, they like, they will kill me. Literally, if I stay up too late. All right, hold on. Let's uh, track. What is this? This is Cliff Rock 24. This needs to be easier. I feel like I want to hit track and click on it. Um, but that might be a little too advanced. Okay, we got that. And then we want to track Cliff Rock 21. Okay, that looks like that worked. All right, so we're going to lock them into place right here at the beginning. Do, 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 do. For if you know somebody made a Colombo map, oh, I'm gonna play it. Don't worry. I'm planning on it. It's gonna be in a video probably Saturdays. This is my goal for that one. I got there's a bunch of new maps, guys, that look awesome. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I don't want this to like start until like. Okay, so that's gonna go boom. Let's track this here and let's track this one there and then it's going to go start moving there. Why does that feel wrong? It's not. It's feel, it just looked weird. Hold on. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, what just happened? Oh, no, I don't want that. Bad, my bad. Stop. Ah. Gosh, these buttons are so small sometimes. Oh my. I, I'm sorry, I just make sound effects with my mouth. Oh wait, you know what I forgot to do? Hold on. I, I need to make an, I need to make it like come back. Like right. There. Come on. It's easier to do it this way. At least for me so far. And now we go. Like, I I feel like ever since I was a kid, like, if I'm, like, doing something, I'm always going to be like... Zzz, brrr, zzz, brrr, zzz, brrr. <laughs> okay, sorry. A lot of my screen is this, like, sequence here. So... Look at that. Isn't that cool? Like, it's the all this movement. Boom. Okay, let's do another one. Like, I feel like I want to jump. So you're going to jump, jump, jump back right there. 
So let's copy this. Alt. Okay. I think that's it right there, right? So then it's gonna boom. Ooh, I don't know if that's gonna be possible. That's gonna be hard. Let's let's uh let's do this animation on these ones and then let's test it. Uh what's up, Isaac? You should put the upper stone higher so that the player would crush inside. Ah, I don't want to do that. I don't want the player to accidentally be able to slip through it. Right? I want them to have to like they have to be able to slip. They have to be able to jump back between. Like the animation right now is just an aesthetic thing. It's like, I want them to jump on the left one, jump to the right one, jump back to the left one. And let's just see how it goes, right? Let's see if they can do it. So let's add, look at my sequence here. It's getting too much. It's gonna have a lot more to it though by the, at the time this is done. So this is Cliff Rock 25. Let's add Cliff Rock 25. And then let's add, oh my gosh, the frog 22. Okay. Uh, there we are. Okay, so let's let's start. Let's hit our start position and both. And then we need our like end position, which is we're gonna say right there okay now let's do the in between oh my gosh okay here we go so let's uh, we're doing rock oh wait 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 no 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 we kind of want it to start right there boop and boop and then let's have it come together Alright guys, this is like, this is one of the reasons I don't always like build on stream or like live because it takes so much concentration to do this properly. Alright, let's push changes. Let's see if this, uh, this works. Um, okay. Sa well, let's save. Let's make sure. <laughs> uh, we don't lose our changes here. Let's give it a try. Woo! Smokey with the two dollars. Thank you so much for the donation, Smokey. Um, you're one of my first says says Meme Central. Well, thank you. Uh, Monster, another addition would be to add a screen shaking effect when the stones collide. It's possible in UEFN. I have no idea how to do that. That's a great uh, uh, suggestion, though. Oh, is Mobile Scrap here? What's up, Mobile Scrap? Good to see you. Uh, Mustard, you want tracking objects to be easier? You can drag the objects from the outliner into the sequencer. What? Dirty assets can't be saved. Oh, I don't know what that means. <laughs> no way. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I gotta try that really fast. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm just gonna make... Thank you. That is amazing. Okay, that that just made that life way easier. Okay, let's wait for these pushes to be changed. Push changes refresh. Did I not push changes? Oh, I guess we gotta do it again. Elding project. Okay. All right. Let's 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 uh, wait for this to update. Thank you for that. Tip by the that was huge. Oh my gosh, that changed my life. Still going. What's up? Yeah, we lost. <laughs> my my computer totally froze when I was trying to do too much at once. And uh Well, what is happening? What's happening on my map? I don't know what's going on. It looks weird here, but looks like it's working okay. Just waiting for it to push. Um for my building, uh just a big like fun death run basically and, but it's gonna be hard it's gonna be like scissors level hard maybe even harder than scissors like i was struggling more with this level 
than I did with scissors level number one level. We'll see though. Take a magical effect that follows the stones. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I don't I, look at. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh gosh. I'm like fighting this every time I come in. Like it's forcing my guy like backwards. I'm like, no, take me back to my islands. <laughs> Stop. Let me back. I can't get over there. Why does it do this? Like, I'm like, oh, come on, come on. Come on, let me out. There we go. Gosh. All right, let's, let's give, let's give this a shot. There's a lot of stuff I don't really know yet, guys. Like, so everything, I'm kind of pushing my skills to the max here. Okay, here we go. Boom. 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 Hurry, you gotta get down to the, oh, that's gonna be a hard jump. That's what I want right there. So I'm gonna have to have like, you're gonna jump back over here and then you have to jump back down to this, the right timing. Oh, that'll be fun. Actually, that's not that hard of a level. It's okay. It doesn't have to be, I guess it doesn't have to be like impossible. Maybe if I made their feet slippery, that would make this impossible. Okay, that'll be fun. That'll be cool. And then if you just sit back and watch, hold on, let me just. I feel like I need to add a sound effect. I have not even tried sound effects yet. I don't even like know how it works. I might have to do that off stream first. To like, oh, let's see. How do I want this to work? Hold on, I'm. Okay, so we got like the jump. You don't even need sprint for this. Go back and forth. And then I want them to be here. And then, hmm. How can I make that work? Hold on. I'm just thinking through as I, whoops. As I try this. Yo, what's up? Name with the $6. When you're finished with the level, then in the next level, make walls left and right that shoot arrows like Indiana Jones. Okay, that could be cool. I've got lots of ideas. I've got lots of ideas for this map. Like I want, oh, oh, okay. I'm just thinking through this. So we got we, the only way to get around this. Although I wonder if you could Neo that I wonder. Let's just try it. I want to see if you can Neo this. Oh, no, I don't think so. Ooh, a Neo level. That would be hard. Maybe if these were just a bit thinner. Oh, like that? Oh my gosh. Wait a second. I gotta try this. I wonder if you could even do it. That could be another level, but I just want to see. <laughs> if you had mantling, it might work. If the, th if the stones were thinner, I think it would work for sure. To do like a moving Neo. Oh my gosh, that would be... That would be so freaking hard. A moving Neo. I gotta think through that, how that would work. Okay. This feels fun, though. Okay, that's... I think that's it. All right. Let's end the game. Let's go back to... My editor. And back to the sequence. Okay, so here... You're on this one. I want you to have to jump back to this one. Boom. And then from here, you're gonna have to jump back. Okay, so I need another, I need another set of these. Man, this is like taking me back right here. We got some like Banjo-Kazooie playing while we're building this. <laughs> All right. Oh, look at this. They're already highlighted over here. Okay, we're gonna try this new trick out. So we got our tracking here. We're gonna plop, bust them down. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is a beautiful, I, I, I'm so happy that you mentioned that that is even possible. That is huge. Man, I wish I could see. I've got so many things on my sequencer right now. Like I feel like 
I just... I'm in trouble here. Okay, so wait, let's see. At the beginning... Here we go... Like, I gotta, like... There's so much going on. Alright, and then right here, it needs to start going down, but then I want it to go back probably right. So, there's where they need to come together. Oh, wait, 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 Right here is where it needs to start. And then, right there, is where they need to come together. A little Pokemon music. All right, there we go. Boom. Oh, wait, what happened? Did I not track that one? Oh, what the? What's happening? There we go. Okay. Let's just do the next set here. Because I think right... And then... Boom. Does that work? Let's see, can you go around? That's gonna like... You're gonna have to jump off, because you're gonna be on this one. And then, let's just see, hold on, let's go like this, shift, alt, oh, I haven't been putting the Niagara effect in these two, I need to do that in just a minute, okay, let's see, what, is that even possible, look at that, that one's kind of grazing it. And you're gonna be on. You're gonna jump onto this one. Okay, that doesn't quite work. Oh, how about we just do this? Okay. I almost wish you could like jump back up to that. Like that would make it so much harder. Actually, I'm curious what's gonna happen with this. Will that push me off? All right, I'm gonna have to try that. Let's just give it a try. Let's push the changes and just see what happens. I don't necessarily love the just floating rock there, but I just want to see what this this feels like when you're playing it. Is this if this level is in a mountain, an idea to make it harder to make rocks falling from above? Hmm. I don't know if I necessarily need it to be harder at this point. And this is kind of like a floating island, but. Like, it's like a floating magical thing. Actually, it might be cool. Did I just push? I pushed changes. Let's just see what it's like once it once it's done. Hopefully it doesn't spawn me out in the middle of nowhere again. I don't know. That, like... I think then, like, sitting there like that is a little funky. But, you know, I don't know if it matters. I don't know. I'll have to, th I'll have to think about it. Like, it doesn't have to make sense. It's just, like, has to be fun, right? Ah, don't do that! Gosh. Oh, it's pushing me again. Stop it. Ugh, maybe if I go do this. Oh, there we go. That resets it. Interesting. Okay. Here we go. Start the game. Because they're just kind of, like, sitting there. Then boom, boom, 
Boom. Oh, that's a fast jump right there. And then, oh, ah! okay, that is kind of hard. Wait, wait a second. I just want to like hold still and see what happens. Does it knock me off the block? Yeah, it does. So you have to jump. That's pretty cool. Oh, I feel like there needs to be something at the end. Like it's like almost, it's almost there. And then you got to jump back. How would that work? I think I might have to change the like last animation on this block. Like you're gonna have to like jump back to it. Okay. Yeah, there needs to, there has to be one more jump there. Like it's too easy. It's it's without the that last jump, it doesn't work. So what we need to do is change. Cause this is coming down too slow, this block right here. So we gotta like, let's see, which one is that? Okay, there we are. Okay, so we gotta like have it come down. There we go. And it's gonna zip down right there where you're gonna have to jump onto it, maybe. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I, I just wanna put something in the way so that like. I just want to see. I don't want to edit any animations. I just want to like see. Oh, whoops, oops, oops, oops. Is that possible? You jump down here. It's going to boom, knock you off if you're on top of that. You're going to have to jump anticipate. Oh, I don't know if that's possible. Maybe if I made that a little further there, that would be possible. All right, let's give it, let's do this. I think that, I think you can do that. Come on, what is going on here? Yeah, that'll work. All right, let's, uh, hold on, let's set up the sequencer. Oh my gosh, I'm. How many things can you even have on one sequencer? Look at this. This is this is a beast. It's a beast. Jeez. Gosh. All right. Here we go. Back. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Back to the start. Let's set these two up. Boom, shakalaka. And then we're going to have it. At the end. Right there. Okay. Okay. So. Holy cow. This is so massive. <gasps> oh, okay. So we want them. I want them like clamping here. But I want them to start. Like it's going to go fast. Actually. I think it's okay if they start there. And maybe a little earlier, right there. And then it's going to clamp right there. Boom. Is that it? Does that look okay? Cool. All right. Oh, okay. Let's see if this is possible. Let's push the change and see what happens. I think that's going to be fun. I think that's going to be pretty dang cool. Oh my gosh. I can't believe how long it's taken to build all this. Like, 
I mean, I guess we started with that, but just to build like that out and then to build the second level, it's taken like almost two hours. <gasps> Everything takes so long. Uh, you're doing some research and it seems like the camera shaking effect is actually created similarly here in UEFN as it's called, as it's creating an Unreal Engine. You can check it. Yeah, I'll have to check that out. I'm making a hard death throw and like scissors. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you enter the level, a quick pause and then cinematic pan. Yeah, well, we'll see. I'll add some cinematic pans maybe later. I still need to like, I haven't really played around with that yet. Like the cinematic stuff. So I definitely want to because I think it just adds a, a deep immersion to the to the levels um, where, when it makes sense. Okay, look, look, it's doing that again. No hands and it's just like making me do it. But when you kind of go in like that, I don't like that glitch. It's really annoying. All right, here we go. Let's try this. Zip. 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 Ooh. Okay, that's pretty cool. Although I didn't finish it. I like, guess actually not too hard. I mean, I think this that'll be hard for the average player. I think for the like average death run player though, that'll be pretty simple. I think it'll be It'll take a few runs to get through it, though. I think that's the point is like being like, all right, how many times is it going to take to do this level before someone gets it? Like, I don't think anyone's going to necessarily one shot this unless they're like watching someone else's video on it. There we go. We did it. It's definitely easier than level one. Definitely easier than level one. That's pretty fun, though. Like, so I feel like most people could do this on either the second or like most death runners could do this on their second or, or third or fourth, you know, kind of try versus I feel like this level is going to take seven, eight, nine, ten tries, you know, before someone gets it their first time. It's going to scare them off this level. Uh, honestly, this should probably be level one. Cause this is like a cool level. Like it's like really fun to like play, I feel like. Versus the other one is not necessarily, it's still a cool level, but it's going to be a rager, right? People are going to be mad at it. Oh gosh, that's a, that last jump's actually kind of challenging. I feel like it works though. Woo, that last one, you got to be quick. That's pretty cool though. I kind of like it. I don't know, what do you guys think? All right, am I gonna add music even if it's subtle? I think so. I think it'd be fun. That is awesome looking. Okay, that looks cool from here. I really, I just kind of want to watch that again. <laughs> it's so unique. Like, man, oh how far creative has come in just like one up, like in one update. Creative 2.0, man. Jeez. Now I'm debating. I feel like I should maybe switch these. Like have it ramp up a little bit. I feel like level one is just a huge ramp up compared to this level. Oh, forgot. I forgot the sequence there. How hard would it be to swap those? Oh, you know what? I don't know how it works with level sequencers when you're like moving it. I bet that would be really hard. So it is what it is. <laughs> or maybe I make another level before this one. That is a little easier. That might be a good option. I don't know. I have to think about that. Okay, so let's now let's uh, make sure we have some my Niagara effects here. Sorry. Oops. People keep texting me in the middle of my streams. It's okay. They're allowed to text me. I'll respond to them later. Do, 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 do. Mm. There we go. And maybe I should have one up here too.
Come on, what happened to my mouse? My mouse disappeared. I hate when it does that. It does that a lot with like games, like even Fortnite, like I'm playing and I'm like, where did my mouse go? The heck? Sometimes my depth perception, my mouse is gone again. Is this Niagara. All right, let's see. I'm curious though. Well, I want to kind of add, I want to see what a VFX device looks like on this. Is there even a VFX device anymore? I don't even know. VFX creator. All right, here we go. I just want to add like a mist. Wait, no, I don't want a VFX creator. Blep. I want a VFX. I want a spawner device. There we go. So I'm just curious if it'll add much to this. I don't even know how to change this. Fireworks. Oh, there we are. I want. I want fog of war. Area fog. I mean. Okay. You know what? I think I want to change this in 1.0. Is it going to be in there? Oh, interesting. Because it's a device, it doesn't update unless I push changes. Holy cow, that's pretty thick. I kind of like it, though. It kind of feels cool. Let's, uh, let's make another one over here. I feel like I should have an ocean down there or something too. Like right now I'm just over nothing. I should probably put something down below. Like, let's just throw in an ocean. Let's just see what happens. Yo, uh, Zeke, uh, sorry, Zeke Kane. Yo, Mustard, made, uh, made a horror map in 1.0 and it's a 10 out of 10. Awesome, dude, that sounds awesome. Uh, let's see, I want, ooh, shit. Ocean. Drop it in. Please don't crash. The heck? What, what do you mean I can't put it in? <laughs> All right, let's just drop it down a bit. What is that hole? I don't even know what that is. I want it like way down, way down south. Okay, that's cool. Okay, let's uh, hold on, let's end the game. Oh, that's why I didn't see stuff because I was in the middle of a game. I hadn't ended it. Dummy, what a dummy. Who's this mustard guy? That feel cool. It feels more magical. I don't know. That might be too much. Let's uh, let's bring it down a little bit. Actually, I'm curious. Let's, uh... Air fog default sound effect. Wait, did they take away? Oh, you can't... Wait a second. Did they take away some of its... Oh, spawn rate. Here we are. I'm gonna make... Uh, maybe increase it a little bit. Let's just see what happens. And I think I want to like two, three, four, five. Hmm. Let's make it a little lower. See, this is, uh, I think this is also where the 1.0 skills come into effect, right? It's like when you want to like just do some simple things like this. But I don't know. I don't know about this. 
I think I'll want to add some like floating islands and stuff off over there. So it makes it feel more like, I don't know, more immersive at some point, but I don't need to do that yet. I don't know if I necessarily want this to be higher. Actually, here's what I could do. Watch this. We're going to change. We're going to increase the height. But it kind of like billows up into the next level as opposed to being like, it looks like a different device. See, look at that. That's cool. That is cool. All right. So then it's like you come over here, you're in this level and it's a little bit higher up. Yeah, I like that. Okay. We get zero plays even from 200,000 views on your Twitter. You got zero plays? I don't understand that, man. Do you have the right code? I missed your super chat. Oh, I did. Oh, wait, hold on. Crystal balls. Crystal, uh, Crystal Breeze with the two dollar, two pounds. How do you import from Unreal Engine into UEFN? Uh, here, I gotta. I'll, I'll drop in a. Uh, hold on. A tutorial for you. Hold on, here we go. Okay, you got it. It's 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 in this tutorial. You can find like some some stuff on how to do that. Can you continue to the back rooms with 2.0? I don't think so, guys. I don't think I'm going to. Like I want to do different things. I I, I was I, we did the. Here, I'm gonna push the changes. Let's see how this plays. I did a lot with the back rooms 1.0. It was an awesome project. Like lasted six, seven, eight months, something like that. And you know, like I I did it for six to seven, eight months. I think it's time. Like I want to do something else cool, right? So this is just like my first attempt at a map. Like I want to make it cool looking. I want it to be fun and different and really interesting. And but not this isn't like a huge. I don't think this is like a huge project, right? This is just kind of like I'm gonna do this, make it really hard, make a big deal out of it when it comes out, and then. I'll move on to something else, but I want to, I do want to have like a big project like the back rooms where I just continually build it up, build it out. And it's like, cool. Oh, look at those stairs. I don't like that. So I'm waiting for the session to, to push and then I might fix these stairs. Cause look at that. I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. It's okay. That's an easy fix though. Back room is kind of a dead meme. It's not even a meme. It's like a whole, I don't know. Oops. It's a whole, uh, like it's got its own cult following and stuff. It's got its own wikis and uh, like, yeah. And it is kind of last year, right? A little bit. So that's another thing. It's just like, it works great at the time. And it's just time. It's kind of time to move on. Look at that ocean. Okay. That ocean adds so much color. I love that. All right, here we go. So boom. And I like the mist. The mist is feeling good down there. I wish I could make it a little bit bigger. Oh, 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 I didn't go fast enough. That last jump, you have to be quick. Okay, I like that. That makes it a little bit more challenging. Oh, whoops. Dang it. I do like the no death death runs, though, where you just kind of come back. Okay. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Dang it. Okay, this is pretty hard. It's not amazing. Like, it's not so hard, but it's hard enough. It's hard enough. Oh, I don't. I don't I'm not gonna make it. Oh no! Wait, wait. wait. We're gonna get this. And I love the feel of this. I really do. And boom. Actually, I'm curious. Can I just? Oh, I can neo around that last jump. <gasps> oh, so you can cheese it a little bit. Actually, I'm okay with that because I want speedrunners to speedrun this too and figure out ways to like go faster. Actually, I'm curious. No, I don't think you can jump from up here. Like, hold on. I want to see if you can. Oh, <laughs> too much lag. I'm curious if you can like make it from that last like height. You can just jump to the very end. Oh, oh. <laughs> that didn't work. Okay, wait, wait, let's give it one more shot. I don't think you can, but I just want to test. 
Whoa! What was that, guys? Uh, that, that was a cinematic. It had its own cinematic there. Don't these, like, rocks look so cool, though? Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, that's impossible. You can't cheese it there, but you can cheese it on that, that last jump. So, right, right here, you can kind of use the momentum. Oh, that's hard, though. Okay, well, what do you guys think? I think that's a good second level. And this is a really good first level. Really hard first level. Jeez. I think what we could do, I've got, I don't think I could start a next level yet. But I think what I want to do is make some, like, I don't know. Maybe some cool decorations around the edges. To make it like to confine, kind of fill this in a little bit. Let's do that. Let's end this right there. Uh, yo, what's up, Austin or Adi? Good to see you. I just realized that moving platforms being a thing, you could totally remake a hard fight from the platforms or something like Undertale. Yes. Oh, actually, there is an Undertale map. Actually, we could go play that real fast. I'm, I'm curious. Put Clombo on the map. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> uh, let's see. You feel like level one is a little bit empty? Oh yeah, yeah. No, I'll make a, I'll make a whole starting area that's like this. Actually, we should probably do that. Should we make our starting area? We should probably make that starting area. Okay, so let's make the starting area look cool. And then it's like, boop, boop, boop. Jump through it. Maybe I can add some stuff around that looks interesting or something. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so let's put... Hmm. I want it to feel different than like this platform's beginning. Drown Colombo? Guys, Colombo's the best. We don't want to drown him. What is that? What does that sound? Oh, that's the... Oh, that's the... Uh, Teleporter. Hey, what happened to my... Oh, that's why this looks funky. There's no platforms there. What happened to my platforms? Got deleted. There we go. That was weird. I, I wonder why that just... I, I'm sure I just accidentally deleted it at some point. There we go. Okay. Let's make the starting area then. Okay. Let's, uh, boom. All right. Actually, what the heck? Why can't I click on this? Is it that Niagara effect? I think it's making it so I can't click on things. What the heck? Come on, get out of the way. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? What the heck? I don't even know what I just did. All right. Let's just grab. Gonna bring this all the way to the front. Okay. Starting to get better at these like movement tools too. I think just a slight, slightly better. Do, 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 do. I love this song. I love this music. It's so good. All right, let's delete this thing. Okay, and then we'll, actually, I actually think I want to make this slightly bigger. What is going on? I cannot like select things properly. What in the? I feel like I'm selecting. What did I just select? What is that huge? Good heavens! There's some, what is that sound? Oh, it's the, oh, it's the teleporter. Okay, the 
teleporter that's causing issues. It's like getting in my way of selecting. Gosh, the teleporter. What the heck, dude? Why do you have such a huge selection area? All right, there we are. That was annoying. No, I don't necessarily love how uniform that looks. Here, I got an idea. Let's try this. Uh, hmm. Let's overlap one, like it's a little bit bigger. See that? I don't know if that actually works. There we go. Look at that. Actually, that's kind of cool, I think. So then, like, now then we can just kind of, like... Still makes it feel, like, still a little bit higher resolution, I think, maybe? Not as uniform, maybe? I don't know. Usually what I do on 1.0 is like the overlapping of things, making it, it tries to make it look a little bit more detailed or a little less like blocky. I just hate that. Oops. I hate that look where it's like blocky. This looks like it might work. Yeah, that feels pretty cool. That feels all right to me. All right. Let's touch this up. Uh, all right, what do we want to add up here though to make it look cool? Let's go to just our Content here Static meshes Add some pillars Although it's already crooked. Whoops. Whoa, 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 wait a Holy cow, that just went out into the middle of nowhere. Wait, what does this one look like? Dang it. <laughs> it comes out like, okay, wait, 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 here's, here's what we need. Hold on, we need like a flat, uh, just a plane. Wait. Uh, hold on, let's do a, Why does it go all the way? That is obnoxious. What is that? Come on, plane! So I just need something flat to put my like objects on. It doesn't. There we are. Okay, so now we can do. Um, yo, what's up, Jackson Gamer? Will you ever try Unity? Also, can you friend me? I can't friend you, and I probably won't try Unity. I mean, I feel like I'm already learning Unreal Engine. Um, but I feel like once you know one, you probably know them all, right? It's just with the little change, like different things. But I feel like Unreal Engine is the engine for like the big games. I mean, Unity's okay, but I feel like I feel like Unreal is like on a different level. I feel like I feel like Unity's like great for like the mobile space, and Unreal's like for other things right but i could be totally wrong just talking out of like i just don't even know what i'm really talking about so sorry if you need folks are watching i don't know i don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> okay maybe 
What is this? That's cool. Just a ball? Wait, is this a material? What's going on? I can't move it. Oh, it's because of my grid snap. Just a giant ball. <laughs> I don't know if I need that. Let's see. Oh, we definitely need some like. He's definitely got some like mossy on him. So I might have to add some moss onto this ground too. I think we can do. Oh man, this makes me want to play some F Zero. Anyone else? Love F Zero. That was that was that game was awesome. Whoa. Holy. That is a huge sword. Okay, wait a second. That's pretty cool. I don't know. That's kind of cool. I like that. Yeah, who doesn't like a sword sticking out of the ground? That's okay. All right, so we got swords now sticking out of the ground. <laughs> uh, I love how much the building's just like me being like, I think that's cool. Wait a second. 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 What if? What if we made this slightly bigger? Oh, you know what we could do too? Aha, I got an idea. A ball! Huh? The ball? <laughs> no? No, not the ball. I don't know, guys. These player spawn pads are kind of ghetto. They're kind of like... They're just kind of like... A little scuffed. I feel like they're not super straight. Just a little bit wonky. Actually, I feel like this needs a Niagara effect now. Well, I don't know with that sword there. Okay, let's uh, let's see. Let's look at this a little more. I feel like I need some more stuff on the edges. I'm curious what this looks like. Not bad. I don't, actually, I don't like the tilt on it right now. Hold on. It's, uh... Ah! Oh, thank goodness for the undo button. Jeez. I uh, mean, that is something creative's been missing since day one. The undo button. Man, it's a blessing. Uh, Z Kane, yo, Muster, what's my fa- What's my- What's my fa- Fortnite creative Reddit called? It's called The Fortnite Creatives. The Fortnite Creatives. I think it's in the description. Should be in the description. I believe. He's 
Is ready for some Wii Sports! Let's get that uh, material. Uh, what was that? An instance? Yeah. I feel like the pillars need something. Let's see. Uh, hmm. I feel like I'm starting to get the hang of things here a little bit. Let's see. What is, what is this? Whoa, whoa. Wait a second. What is that? Uh, let's not use this yet. I feel like it could be something for later in the level. What is this? It's a monolith. We don't need that yet. Do 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 do. Okay, cool stuff, but I don't know if we need it. Okay, I think what we need now. Actually, wait, 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 wait. wait. We were talking about the pillars, right? Well, there we go. Headless lady. Okay, that's not terrible. Hold on, let's just see what it looks like if I put her over here. And then let's rotate her on this side. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like if I do that, these pillars don't really have moss on them. Do I have to put the mo like the mossy effect on it? Let's try it. Let's just see what it's like. Because it doesn't really go vertical very well. Well, there we go. That's not too well. Yeah, look at that. It's terrible on that side. Okay, no mossy ladies on the top. Sorry, mossy ladies. Oh, uh, let's see. What else we got? Ugh. <laughs> Maybe it doesn't need anything on top. Maybe it just needs like, uh, well, let's just see what this looks like. Hold on. Another mossy pot. Nah. Let's do like, okay. I think what we need is like some stones in between. Ah, what are you doing? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> so weird. See, that's pretty cool. Like it's, it's, it just feels, so there's some things that are super intuitive in this system. There's also some things that are not, but I feel like placing this is, I think once I get used to it, it's going to come a lot faster. Do, 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 do. Hold on, we got to rotate that a little bit. Okay, it's starting to turn out, I think. Let's rotate this. Looks too uniform. There we go. Um, let's try this. Let's copy this one. There we go. Well, I don't know. What do you guys think? 
Let's, uh, let's see. What does it look like in the game? <laughs> Woo! Uh, let's push the changes. Here we go. Let's see what it looks like. I don't know. Yo, what's up, Rain? Attempt number 10 of asking most players to do a Spider-Man map. Double jizz is this is gonna take a while, isn't it? Uh... Maybe. The, the problem is, is I have to be so careful about anything IP related, right? Spider-Man maps can't really do anymore. Like as long as it, I mean, you could build New York City, right? I think that would be it. And then you could play swing around in it. So I think that would be something you could do, right? Build New York City in UEFN. That'd be pretty cool if someone would do that, actually. That, that's actually not a bad idea. Loading! Yo, what's up, guys? What's up, Speedy Crust? Uh, you should make an SCP map. I think with 2.0, you can make a perfect game like the one from the first person comes. That could be really cool. Uh, that, I mean, that might be like a, like a fun Backrooms 2.0 kind of thing, right? SCP is kind of similar in the Backrooms where it's just like, kind of build whatever level you want, similar. I don't really know that lore very well, but it's something I'm like interested in. Okay, we're uh, waiting for it to update. We'll see how this looks. Um, so yeah, that's a good suggestion. Should make a fracture themed map at some point. Oh, you mean like from the like the new update or the new season? Yeah, maybe. I feel like you guys can do a better job at a lot of this stuff than I can, right? I feel like for me, I gotta do, do stuff that I'm like, I feel passion, passion about. And like, I have some ideas for things, but I, I don't have the skills yet to do it. And so I'm, I'm trying to like slowly build up my skills. And like, this is the kind of stuff for me that's like building my skills. Like I'm getting in, I'm practicing. Just moving, building. Like a lot of people are like, how do I get started in creative? This is it right here, right? You just, I say, okay, I want to, whoa. Dude, it looks even better in the game. Like when I do, when I'm looking at it here, it looks cool. But when I'm looking in here, it looks even better. Wait, hold on. We got to make these. Wait, it is not. Oh, wait, let's see what happens when I start the game. Yeah, that looks awesome. And even these pillars have... Oh, yeah! <laughs> Look at that! It's got some of the, like, moss on it effect. I mean, that's okay, I guess. It's not that big a deal. That looks cool. Doo -doo. Doo -doo. And then you go out here. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, my gosh. I don't think I can do this. Let's see. <gasps> All right, we gotta wait for this one to drop, and then we'll go. Why would you drop? Okay, there you go. All right, here we go. This is such a hard level. Ah! Shoot. <gasps> gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Oh my gosh. All right. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. See, I feel like by the time I'm done this map, the uh, like other levels are gonna look, oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Oh, dang it. I went too fast. I feel like, the later levels are going to be so much better than the first levels because I will have improved in skill significantly from these first levels. So you got to kind of wait for that one to... There we go. Oh, no! Dang it. Okay, wait. I got to beat this level. We got we to gotta beat it. It is difficult. It is very difficult. Wait for it. Wait for it. We gotta, I got to wait for that to drop. Okay. It's all about timing. So this, this first one is best to go after it's dropped and then you can kind of go and then you got to time it. Woo! Uh, that jumps the hardest right there. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We got to wait. So you got a little bit of time to do this first level, that first jump. And then you got to kind of wait, jump as that's coming up. Wait for that to drop. Wait for it to start coming up and you wait and then that one stops and then Jump, yes! Oh, wait! How did I mantle that? Does this not have collision on it? Okay, I gotta bring that out a little bit, I think. But, okay, there we go. And then we got this level. Um... Ah! No! 
Oh, okay, well, everything's working so far. That's good. I don't know how many levels I'm going to make this. It's got to be, I don't know. I think if they're all like this challenging, they can, it could, I can get away with like a 10 level death run or something, but I might make it like somewhere between 10 and 20. Okay, this is coming together. I don't know. What do you guys think? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Yay. Yeah. Y for yes and for no. No, I don't ever want to play this. It's too hard. Oh, wait, I got to build out this bottom too. Okay, let's do that real quick. Oh, uh, let's end the game. Can you remake the back rooms? I'm not going to remake the back rooms. I'm just going to say no. We're just saying no, right, for now. That doesn't mean I won't ever get back to it. I just don't think, I think it's kind of, I think the back rooms is kind of, we've, we've played it out, guys. It's, it's, it's all played out. Yikes, that didn't work. Lots of W, wise, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, anyone who doesn't want to play this. <laughs> I want you want a mustard bottle battle pass? Oh, that'd be cool. There we go. Okay, wait, wait. Let's. Uh, uh, I just. I gotta add. We gotta do this bottom part because it just doesn't make sense to have. At least compared to the other things, it needs to have something to float on. Make it a bigger. Barg. Oh, come on, come on. What's... Oh, was it... Dang it. That stupid effect. Is it sticking up at all? Doesn't look like it. Okay. It is in the back a little bit. Do, 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 do. Okay, hold on. I mean, this is this is pretty cool, I guess. I guess. I guess. Yeah, wait, hold on. Oh gosh, dang it. Silly effect. Oh, I love this song. This is from, uh, this is from Metroid. Man, Metroid is, that's one of my all-time favorites. That's one thing I have a dream of making. I really want to make a Metroidvania game in like a side-scrolling, really thought, well thought out, like Metroid type game and creative. I think that would be fantastic. Okay, let's look at this. Yo, what's up, Arcade? How'd you get the moss? Generate on the props? It's a material instance that I had downloaded. Uh, let me show you. Actually, I'm gonna do a little bit right here. So, let me show you. It's right here, it's this decal, it's like a decal material instance. Right here. And then I just prop it on top. And it just kind of like attaches to it. I don't have any idea how that works. But all I know is it, it works. There we go. And then, uh, what was I gonna do? I was gonna do something. Shoot, I was gonna do something. <gasps> oh yeah, I remember. Um, let's do. Ah. Let's just do the content drawer here. Uh, ba 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 ba. Static mesh is what I want. Do 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 do. do that okay and the cool thing about that static message is it just automatically places on top of these other things isn't that awesome How cool is that So many things like I'm learning. I feel like every time I start to build in UAFN, I'm like, 
Wait, what? Like, I've already learned. I, I, there's like probably 10 things I've learned today just building that are like kind of like mind blowing to me. And I'm like, wait, what? You can do that? So much of this is just like playing with it, right? You just gotta, you just gotta get into it and just start building. And I know anyone who's watching as a console builder is like, <gasps> shut up, bastard. <laughs> You'll get your chance, I hope someday. I really do. I didn't have a, I didn't have, I, I mean, I didn't have access to anything like this when I was a kid, not even close. Okay, hold on. Let's bring this in. So... Isn't that cool? I feel like that looks cool. That's pretty cool, I think. I think that looks pretty pretty sweet. Do you love where you're running away from something like a boulder? I like that idea, Galaxy. I actually, I've got a lot of ideas for this. Like, just really fun things I think that will work. Um, All right, guys. I think that's it for me today. I got to wrap up. Got to go be with the family. And... Um, have dinner with my kids and stuff, but this is, I feel like we have really good progress here. This looks awesome. Looks cool. It plays cool. Kind of hard. <laughs> and uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll keep building this out, guys. Maybe I'll stream again, building it. Whoa, look at that. I don't know if that's good or not. Well, anyway, do you guys like the streams? Should I stream more? My goal is to stream every other week. So we'll see how that goes. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> and... Yeah, so I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited about all of this. This is pretty fun. Um, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Tomorrow, watch out for a video. We're going to be busting lots of myths tomorrow about UEFN. Should be fun. And yeah, see you guys later. There's no code for this yet. No code for this yet, but it should be soon. Thanks again for all the donations. Thanks for the love. Thanks for the likes. I love you guys. 